no dia 1975. Dia pra caralho. É... Pra quem não sabe, eu upei tudo. É, upei... é, eu upei tudo até agora lá no YouTube. Menos o último episódio. A última vez que eu joguei eu ainda não upei lá. Mas eu vou upar esse aqui também. Aqui não deu tempo de upar tudo. Pei tudo, pei tudo, pei tudo. Vamos continuar aqui, mano. Basicamente tá o caos do caos. A gente tá contra o governo mesmo, se foda. É isso. É isso o, o, o resumo que a gente tem. É o caos do caos, estamos contra o governo. A esterilidade. Só que esse jogo é. é ele tá tudo dando errado. E esse jogo é aquilo, né, mano? Mesmo a gente estando contra o governo. Uh, quem tá contra o governo também tá fazendo merda. Então, os dois estão tão muito errado. É... Mas a gente tá contra o governo, se foda, no jogo. Mesmo dando merda, ataque terrorista pra todo lugar, se foda, mano. Vamos lá, vamos lá, vamos lá. Ih, tirou meu negócio aqui. Pega aqui tudo. Oh, Winston. I've checked the schedule for tonight. Nothing particularly important to report, but I'm sure you'll manage to find some new way to disappoint me. Still, at least my daughter's in for Advance's new initiative. I should liven things up a bit here on the 15th floor. Try not to cause me any more headaches. Bozeman out. Tá, cadê? Ih, caralho, só tem isso. Não. Só tem comércio. Nossa, tem dois comer. Nossa, que merda, velho. Dois comercial da Advance. Não tem o Nail. Não tem mais nada aqui, velho. Puta, que bosta, mano. Nem o maluco sumiu. Eu vou ter que passar. Cancela o jogo. Sem nem o maluco, sem não like. que é então, nem o maluco é muito foda, velho. Ah, mano, nem eu não, velho. Ah, mano. Não tem nenhuma fitinha aí terrorista, não? Uma fitinha aí da. da. da interrupção? Ah, ah, mudou tudo, caralho. Atualizaram todos os sistemas aqui, pelo visto. As TVzinhas aqui, ó. Tá mais atualizado. Não tem um contrabando de arma, velho. That's Colin. He, um. Só tem coisa a favor do governo, que merda, Vamos lá, né? Good evening and welcome to the NNN. I'm Megan Wolf. And Megan Wolf. This you might be wondering. <laughs> well, it's Bring Your Daughter to Work Day here at Channel One. So I'm joined tonight by my foster daughter, Stacy. Say hello, Stacy. Go fuck yourself. All right then. Here are the stories that matter to you. First up. With advance confirming that the nuclear fallout from the 20 week war is to blame for the drop in birth rates across the territories, we asked you what keeps you going. I know that I, for one, was quite deflated when I heard about this, but reading all the submissions has really put the smile back on my face. This is from Sonia in Larkfordshire. I've had plenty of time to fill, so I've started a new hobby. Since I started knitting, I remember that 85% Depois a gente vai assistir o programa todo, tá, gente? Agora eu não consigo prestar atenção exatamente no que tá sendo falado, então eu quero assistir depois o programa assim como sempre. And if you've started a new hobby, do write in and tell us about it. Next up, you know how we love your uncanny comestible coincidences and Don't know about you, but I think this one really takes the biscuit. <laughs> I'm not sure what I'm going to do. The things our viewers spot will be unbelievable way our menu centers are now able to feed every team member every single day. Greg from Proddington has sent us this lovely photo of their breakfast saying, I couldn't bring myself to eat my toast this morning because I could swear it bore the spitting image of the great Julia Salisbury's relationship. Ah, não, ela não, velho. Tô tá falando muito bem, mano. Do keep those coming in. Come on, let's go. Another go. 
Uh, we've just got time for one more of your stories, and this one is an inspiring story of rehabilitation. Uh, that's it, just I know. tell us who it's from. Wukaki. Yeah, and then read it out. Okay. Um, so this one says it's from John in Stokely. Before I was convicted, Esse I read de... a single book. But since I was ah, não, released, não é o mesmo cara que tinha sido preso. Prisão perpétua. É ele? Eu acho que não é. Eu só... <risos> love hearing the way our neighbors and team members have been able to become better people so do let us know your stories here you can do this bit Stacey <laughs> no you're right come on give it a try let us know your stories here at the NNN right change of pace coming up here. You'll need to use the S-Effect buttons for the next segment. Advance have already selected when and what to use. Simple stuff. Just Ih, follow your government orders. Puta, é... Tá, pera, pera. Eu vou ter que usar esses botões de acordo com o... o que o governo quer. Ordem do governo. Ai, caralho. A gente mete o louco. A gente pode meter o louco, mandar o pau no cu do governo e meter o louco pra não fazer o que eles querem, velho. Vou colocar o contrário. Porque a gente tá... Mano, a gente já tem uns comercial do governo. Alan, a gente não sabe o que aconteceu, porque a última vez que a gente fez alguma coisa pra ele foi pego. Nem existe mais, pelo visto, né? Tudo isso. Vamos meter o louco. Vamos meter o louco. Ele morreu, então. Eu acho que ele foi pego. Não que ele morreu. Tá tudo uma merda, então. Não falou em nenhum momento que ele morreu. Ouvimos tiros, exato. Mas eu quero confirmações, gente. Para! Para, pô! Mudou toda a aberturinha. Tonight on the NNN, it's time to celebrate this week's team lottery winners live from the Shakespeare Theatre right here in the capital. We're going to hand over to Julia Salisbury. I suppose you don't think much of her either, eh, Stacey? She's got a lot more going for her than you wankers. Okay. Surprising vote of approval there from Stacey. Let's go live to that right now. Good evening, everybody, and welcome to this week's no team awards. <risos> Ficou quieto. Eu não vou apertar, mano. Eu não vou apertar em nenhum. Ah, caralho, eu apertei errado. Eu não vou apertar, mano. Eu não vou apertar. <risos> Ela é quietinha. I am delighted to be joined here tonight by one of the oldest people in Territory One. He was born over 107 years ago. Please give a warm team welcome to Alfie Touch Badger. <laughs> so, Alfie, ah, you've seen so much in your lifetime. What have been some of the highlights? <laughs> Alfie? You're right. <laughs> His hearing aid isn't turned on. Oh, could you turn it on? <laughs> <laughs> Não dá para colocar errado, gente. É só o que ele quer mesmo. He says it drains the battery. Well, uh, will you tell him that we'll buy him é, a brand new nos outros, battery gente. after the presentation? <laughs> <laughs> O silêncio, mano. And I will I will help him with that. Yeah, if you would. <laughs> Sorry, can't get the staff. <laughs> We got it. So, Alfie, what? You're 107 years old. Oh, don't bloody remind me. <laughs> would you like to tell the audience what that's like? 
where is everybody? Um, out there, in the dark. <laughs> Bless him, it's not just the ears. Who are you? Uh, two sugars, please. <laughs> tá loucão, já de velho. Prime Minister. A lovely story. Who are you really? No, no, I, I really am the Prime Minister. Oh, oh so you're a, a, a you know, a, a woman. A, yeah, a woman. One, one of Women them. can do anything men can do these days, Alfie. Uh, can you piss? Ele tá louco. <laughs> Ele tá, lá. Ele tá I louco de velho mesmo. <laughs> no, I didn't think so. Two sugars, please, and not too much milk. Uh, Shall we get to the awards, Alfie? Oh, aren't you going to ask me about my life? Well, I'm not sure we have enough time left now for that, so... When I was nine, I wanted a pet, so I asked me mum and pap. There was no television then, back then, you know. We made our own to entertainment out of coal and roadkill. <laughs> well, that's fascinating. So they got me a pet, see? But it weren't a dog. They told me it were a dog. But it were a stone. A stone? Yes. So I called it Patch, which were a popular name for a dog back then, on account of the king having a patchy face. Eu não tô prestando atenção tanto, gente, o que ele tá falando, eu juro pra você. Algumas coisas só. Eu tenho que ficar ligado o que tem que fazer, né? Oh, how romantic. She threw my dog in the river. That was the day I decided I'd never marry. And that's the secret to your long life? Oh no, I've been married seven times. Vocês estão mandando de dois pontos, não tem ideia. Yes, up with number three, see? Yes, I'm just lucky. <laughs> Are we going back to the home soon? Uh, soon, Alfie. <laughs> First, let's turn to the reason we're all here. The weekly terrorism team award. Não vou apertar nenhum, mano. Se foda. <laughs> First up tonight is a lady who really knows how to put in the extra hours. She works at a transition center in Hamble Bamblebury and she has single-handedly allowed more families to unburden each other than any other nurse in Territory One. In the uneven path, she'd have been locked up. Tonight, she is being honored as a team player. Please welcome Daphne Snister. Uh, are you here to change me? Just uh, give her a medal, Alfie. There's a good boy. <laughs> oh, gotcha. I mean, two sugars, please. Uh, and don't let it steep too long. I think you're supposed to give me one of those. Oh. Oh. Ah. Well, I, I, I... There he goes. Look! <laughs> I can't get the arms up any higher than that. You'll have to go down, love. Uh, um, thank God those fractious times are behind us. And now the territories are thriving. Are we in? As the actors said to the bishop. <laughs> yes, thank you. I've got it from here. Well done. Daphne Smith to everybody. Now, open your envelope and find out what you've won. Crikey, don't hold back there. She's tougher than one of Peter's homemade Ethel's cakes. Got it. Oh. I've won a holiday for two in Territory 15. Territory 15, man. San Palmarino, didn't it? As I believe it did. Yes. Olha lá, eles estão chamando de território. Tiraram todos os nomes das coisas, mano. We're all one nation now. Ah, não, não vou, não vou. Eu não vou montar nada, não, mano. Não vou montar. Não vou montar. Não vou mutar, não vou mutar. I've been in these white fronts for three days now. We'll get to that, Alfie. Oh, right you are, love. Next up tonight is a couple from Farnley who, after a rocky start losing their family... É legal que a, a Megan com a filha tá ali, a filha do ativo. Tá ali assistindo e ela não tá gostando, ela tá emburrada até agora. Há que deixar muito tempo no mesmo... Na mesma câmera dá ruim, mano. Fico esquecendo disso. I had a pal called Scotty Wilson. He was from way up north, so I didn't understand a bloody word he said. But he were my best mate. 
Should we just grab them for ourselves? Probably for the best. <laughs> and his best mate was Smudger A. Eu tô pegando a medalha porque vai tá contando as coisas. Lady Sydney. She <laughs> were a girl. But she had a boy's name, so they shipped it to the front anyway. <laughs> First girl any of us has ever seen, close up. She's dead now. They all are. Smudger and Scotty never made it home. Fiddly got shanked in Frank's worst prison in an argument over an olive. And Terry, he exploded quietly at home. Sydney got a fatal skin condition. Scratched herself to death. It makes you think. Thanks, Alfie. Great contribution. <laughs> so, Otho and Lavinia, a petting zoo. After we lost all our wealth, well, we discovered there were actually people who had never even owned a pony. Are you three? <laughs> so we decided to do something about it. Uh, that's the type of people we are, you see. Advantage of a private education, probably. Well, I'm sure we could debate that all night, but there's no time. So, let's see what you've won. Yes, but before we do, there's something I wanted to say to you. Oh, absolutely. Every citizen of the new future has my ear. Good. When advance came to power, you took all of our wealth. Took the shirts off of our backs. Quite literally, in my case, I used to collect shirts. Well, you might as well have the rest of it, too. Que isso? Oh. Oh god, not again. I said once I said it. Oh, the pelado. <laughs> Eu não vou, eu não vou. Eu não vou mostrar nudez na TV também não, mano. Ela <risos> ele dando a mãozinha. Stop them. Oh, don't worry, love. I'll protect you. Oh, 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 oh. What's going on, velho? Meu Deus do céu! This reminds me of when I was in my twenties, and we go to the promenade, shining on sea, and watch all the pretty girls on the beach. Everything was black and white then, of course. We'd visit the Penny Arcade and try to win a block of lard. Tá batendo. Tá acabando com ela ali. Eles estão, eles estão batendo na moça. O que que tá acontecendo? Everyone else was recruited by the circuses. There were loads of them, you see, circuses, with their big tents and their candy floss. Ela é preocupada, mano. Mostra, mas aí vai perder a audiência. Não funciona assim nesse jogo. Porque tá vermelho. Se tivesse verde ou laranja embaixo, beleza. Mas não tá. Se fosse assim de box e não contasse a audiência, beleza, eu mudaria. Mas se tá vermelho embaixo, eu não posso. Que aí eu perco toda a audiência possível e eu falho. Our final winner tonight is a go-getter who really went and got him, helping to root out more than 170 disrupt collaborators in his own neighborhoods. Since then, <laughs> he's been <laughs> <started laughs> a <laughs> senior <laughs> Caucasian <laughs> cadet leader and organized all of the entertainment at last year's camp cooperation. Our final winner tonight, Edwin Neverlay. <laughs> Aê. You should be in a transition center, you old nonk. Prime Minister. It's an absolute pleasure to finally meet you. Caralho, mano. 
in my opinion. <laughs> well, I've never been much of a role model. Não vou, não vou. Zero, zero reações, mano. You have four enemies, foreign and domestic, with nine fists. As with my own tiny fists, have I? Well, let's open the envelope and find out what you've won. Maybe it'll be a fist enlargement. <laughs> Years internship as a behavior coach at Betty. It's just what I've always wanted. Let's show the fools where they went wrong, eh? Well, actually, betterment is about rehabilitation, Edwin. Absolutely. And if they don't reintegrate, we retaliate. Just like you did on Liberation Night. <coughs> Thank you for this award. And stay vigilant. Report the non cohesives. Be a team player. <coughs> Concludes tonight's awards. Uh, join me next week when hopefully <laughs> things will be a lot normal. more normal. Back to you, Megan. <laughs> Prime Minister Salisbury there at a highly eventful team awards ceremony. Any thoughts on this week's winners, Stacey? The first was fucking scary. The pre tees were saggy, and that little Sag prick one. will never lose his virginity. Okay. Succinctly put there, if a little profane. After the break, we'll be going live to a star studded premiere. You won't believe who's on the red carpet tonight. Don't go anywhere, we'll be back after this. And we're out. Oh, Alex, one other. What's that? You're off already? I know you had to take the day of work, but you knew it. Oh, I see. No luck still with the other. I'm so sorry, darling. I'll speak to you later. Oh, Alex. Completely forgot what I was going to say. Blast it all. <laughs> yeah, Still, I'm lucky, I'm lucky, lucky to have them. Spiraling out of control into some kind of tragic comic disaster. Yeah. <coughs> tá, vai terminar logo logo esse aqui. Volta do meu lado, é por causa que sai daqui. Jeremy, are you watching us? Are you receiving us? Are you fucking with us? Oh right. So she can swear. Foi C, de caralho, Phelps, é muito bom. Nossa, mas foi muita coisa nesse aqui, velho. Foi dificinho, mano. <risos> tá passando o comercial da Advance, mano. Que dia é feio. Que que vai ter, mano? Porra, velho, tem mais dois blocos. <risos> O que que vai ter so, nisso aqui, mano? Lá vai. Futebol de gato, pode ser qualquer coisa, mano. Pera, tá... Tá, tá laranja, eu posso apertar. Eu posso apertar, eu vou apertar. Eu vou apertar, eu posso apertar. <risos> Se tá laranja, não que vai ser muito bom. Mas não tá vermelho. O vermelho é que dá horrível. O laranja fica ok. Mas o foda é que fica 19 segundos no laranja, pode ser que dê merda. Entendeu? O laranja, ele é ok pra mostrar. Só que não por muito tempo. Eu vou... Faltando 10 segundos, eu aperto. Faltando 10 segundos. É porque tava passando comercial e eu não queria o comercial da Advance. Mas eu passei bastante. Então dá pra cortar o comercial da Advance, ok. We first covered this film almost five years ago, back when it was called The Medicated. Then, for mysterious reasons, the film was suddenly pulled the night before its release. Well, since then, executive producer George Focus has spent five long years polishing the film and turning it into a special edition and premiering tonight. With extensive state-of-the-art visual effects and a top-quality voice team, George says it's the movie he always wanted to make. Now, let's take a look at it. Peraí, já me viu. 
Você não viu? É porque é isso que ela falou Que eles tiveram que refazer o filme Eles tiveram que refazer, mano Eu que você real, baby Flesh and blood Captain Quasar. But you're just ones and zeros, baby. If only I'd noticed. Meu Deus do céu, mano, esse jogo é muito de propósito as coisas e quando acontecer pra eu não saber o que que é acontecendo. Eu não sei o que tá acontecendo no filme. Ok, so head north on Interstellar Avenue, left at the asteroid belt, and a tricky three-point turn at Uranus. What are these symbols? This corner, this, this is the key. We can shut it down. Yes, yes, we can shut it down. But we have to ask ourselves, who are we? What's going on, man? Who are we? What is this? Gosh. Thrilling stuff. What did you think, Stacy? Que foi isso, mano? Ela não quer falar. Fala, Stacy. The robots were all right, I guess. E ela Stacey, gosta dos robôs. Let's Boa. go over to Robin Short now in Western Square, who I believe has got the star of the show, Robin. Well, Megan, I'm joined by not one, but both Boa. of the stars, Lawrence Blunderclatch and Helena Canterbury Bochu. Thank you so much. No, thank you. Caralho, nem a pau, mano. É pra eu não ver o programa mesmo. Puta que pariu, velho. Eu quero assistir o programa. Vocês conseguem assistir, vocês conseguem, ou não? I feel very lucky, very, very lucky to be born, well, you know. And Helena is in massive demand too at the moment. She's still the face of a major cosmetics brand and she's booked to do a one woman Lear in the summer. Wow, it sounds like you're both very busy, mm -hmm. but is there any chance we'll get to see you together on screen again? No, no, I'm really not supposed to mention this, but we are doing a little something together. No. I'm playing a weathered starship captain from another galaxy and Helena ah, que is merda, like mano. Eu quero saber. <laughs> but how does that work? I spend seven hours in makeup now. No, um, how does Helena play a droid? Oh, we just pop her on a roller skate. Wow, well... Lawrence Blunderclatch and Helena Canterbury Boatshoot, thank you so much for joining me. And we're going over to Patrick Bannon now. Patrick, Patrick Bannon. Will we'll be seeing you in a movie anytime soon? Thank you, Robin. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> Mas... I'm joined here by <laughs> oh, Patrick, icon. Mano. It's Lil C. <laughs> and her father, <laughs> country singer and alien worshipper, Billy Bob Jean Short. Howdy. <laughs> So, ah, não, de novo, nem a pau, mano. She knows what she's done. O que, que é isso? É a Miley Cyrus, Hannah Montana? Well, love this look. Is it one of yours? No, you know it's not. We don't do that anymore. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Your clothing label went bankrupt, didn't it? <laughs> yes, because a certain TV show failed to fulfill their contractual obligations. <laughs> well, you look great. <laughs> oh, well, that's probably due to her new cosmetics and wellness brand. I'm not sure that it is. <laughs> Let her show you. This oh. is our new eyeshadow oh. palette. She oh. calls this one Glands. Wow, it's scented. <laughs> wow, that was a surprise. And this next one, this is our new lipstick. We call this show Caralho, mano. Lips. Oh, oh. wow. Why is it so salty? Oh. It's organic. Mm. And this. Our next one, this body spray. Mm. This is a body mist which rebalances your hormones <laughs> and actually smells like fertility. Oh, right, yeah. <coughs> wow. Mano, o que ele tá fazendo? Yeah. Yeah, that burns. Oh. All this is part of Lil C's uh. new range, 
Pera, Lucy era aquela menina que cantou da outra vez lá? Ah, é ela. Só que ela não tá mostrando o rosto. Britney, é Britney. Now remember, we need the money. So, she's also available for parties, weddings, funerals and bar mitzvahs. Well, thank you. We'll see. Depois eu vejo o que que tem aí, né, mano? Oh, it looks like Robin has got hold of Jesus. Jesus. Jesus, mano, boa. It absolutely is, Patrick. Jesus. I almost can't believe you're here. How have you been? É o Jesus, mano. Walk amongst the people every now and then. Eu adoro Jesus, mano. Amém. Now, there are rumors going around that you might be running for office. Is there any truth to that? Mano, eu tô muito curioso com tudo isso. But you're aware that elections have been suspended in the territories. No, I'm I'm not running to be no prime minister. Oh, you're not? No. I'm going to be king of the moon. King of the moon? Yes. No, sorry. You're running for king? Of the moon? No, not running. It's my birthright. Ah, <coughs> and does this have anything to do with promoting your upcoming hip opera, Chase in Space? Hush now. Cynicism is so on moon. Ah, uh, okay. And how long will this last? Will it go the way of last year's Living as a Mouse fiasco? Or maybe your foray into ventriloquist beats? I don't make the moon rules. I merely live by them. <laughs> so, are you looking forward to seeing the automated? You know, I don't believe in film. Thou shalt keep thine image still and holy. That's track for Jesus Christ made us though. Okay, thank you for your time and good luck with your new life in space. And with you, my child. <risos> Eu quero muito ver o que, que é isso. <risos> well, Megan, that's what success looks like. I'm gonna see if we can grab someone else to have a chat. Back to you. Thanks, Robin. But I think Stacy and I are probably in quite enough trouble where we are. So, three big names there, Stacy. Yeah, big names. Any thoughts about them? Maybe from your generation's perspective? You won't like my opinions. <risos> Try me. <risos> well. Bumbanonk is so old he's like one week away from a transition centre, so who cares? And Lucy was cool when I was like 12 or something, but now she's just another fucking loony. And Jesus is a disrupt loving wanker who should have died with the rest of them three years ago. Mm, you're right. You agree with me? No, you're right. I don't like your opinion. But <laughs> hopefully we can go back to Patrick now, <laughs> who has another familiar face to catch up with. Oh, Patrick, what's the atmosphere like there? <laughs> It's absolutely electric. Vai estar aqui de novo, né? Mas é It's crazy Neil. Hey, hi, ho, how you doing? É, eu não consigo assistir, mano. Eu não consigo assistir o programa, velho. Eu não consigo. It's crazy. People stop me in the streets, they expose themselves. É ele, é ele, mano. Ele é meio maluco, eu adoro ele, mano. Eu amo. Eu acho que é porque eu, eu passei tanto pro comercial dele, será? Será que faz sentido isso? Eu não sei, né, mano? Eu passei tanto comercial dele que ele tá famosão agora. Eu 
We got crazy deals on chairs. You have a sit in a chair. Aí, oferta, up, mano. Aproveita, aproveita, mano. But what do you say? We got a deal? Uh, well. Well, what about Betty Andrews handbag? It's real leather. It's real cheap. And it even contains our heart medicine. Spicy. Uh, no, really. I You've got the chair. Oh. You've got the bag. Eu quero saber, You're mano. Really busting my balls. What can I do to convince you? Let me throw in my wife. This is Neil. <laughs> It's the latest model. Not a scratch on her. Pearls like a charm. <laughs> What do you say? We got a deal. Look, I, I really I can't take your wife. Yes, you can. I got loads of them. Oh. Come on down. A crazy deal. <laughs> We got crazy deals on chairs. We got crazy deals on meals. We got crazy deals on wheels. <laughs> We got wheels on meals. <laughs> meals <laughs> on meals. <laughs> We even got endangered seals. And we got meals with endangered seals. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Neil. Well, it's always a dream mano, ele é muito bom, hero. mano. How que atores fodas, again. mano. Toda Man vez eu tenho que falar Aren't isso. We lucky. <laughs> Back to you. <laughs> Thanks, Patrick. What a Patrick. Colorful uh, interview there on what looks like an amazing night. They certainly know how to make an entrance. I hope. And the automated really does seem to have unstoppable written all over it because despite Boris Horsey in Hours magazine calling it Lawrence Blunderclatch's overly long suicide note in a review which ends with the words and he hasn't even had the decency to see it through, the film which is free to all residents of the territories has seen record pre-bookings and looks set to run for months and months but Let's go back to those lucky few seeing it tonight. Oh, I'm so jealous. Robin, you seen anything unusual there? Well, I thought I saw some leprechauns in the green room, but I think it might have been someone's kid. <laughs> but I know, they just keep coming. And here are some more famous faces, or famous brains, I suppose. It's Dr. David Wong, and Dr. Ingrid is also here. We have been following your life so closely on our show over the last few years. What's it like to be back on dry land? It's so wonderful. I'm still not used to it. Every time I see the sun, I want to just scream out in joy. <laughs> I'm grateful every day to your viewers for their support. Without them, well, we wouldn't be here. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. And am I right in thinking that you two have a lovely little boy together? Dante's three now, and he's gorgeous. Oh. What a beautiful family. Not since she left me. Oh. oh, excuse me, I, I, I didn't mean to. Um... It's fine. <laughs> oh, it's fine, is it? Well, what happened? Well, you know, the normal Cacetinho, story. Cacetinho, mano. Sometimes things aren't as easy as they were when all you had was a key. Uh, no sooner was she able to see me in daylight. Isso aí é porque eu escolhi também, eu acho. With a Não sei. Que eu podia... Ah não, isso aí passou sempre. Não, isso aí passava independente. Caralho. At least she doesn't have a PhD in biomechanics. You take that back. Well, thanks to you both for pushing the boundaries of human knowledge. Arthur. Crikey! Well, the movie's about to start, so Patrick and I are about to share a box of overpriced popcorn. Back to you, Megan. Thanks, Robin. Lucky you, and enjoy the movie. The Automated opens in cinemas across the territories this weekend. What a star-studded event, eh, Stacey? Who cares? No one goes to the cinema these days. Of course. We'll be back after these messages. I still go to the cinema. You should get yourself a video recorder, like the one at the home. Well, yeah, I've got a video recorder. It's just not the same, is it? You're right, it's better. No unevens chatting and chewing all the way through. Oh, well, what about a kiss and cuddle on the back row? Doesn't that happen anymore? In public. Mano, os três comerciais é coisa da advência, mano. Nothing's wrong with me. Ih, olha lá, mãe filha. Ah, ah, consegui a, consegui a.
Melhor relacionamento de mãe e filha. Oh, não se preocupe, é Soko. É o que agora? Essa aqui não vai para o ar mesmo. Oh, é a Megan. Ela vai te entrevistar. Olá, Stacey. Olá, Stacey. Lá vem, mano. O que, que vai acontecer? Não, I'm sorry, but if we can't be polite, you're gonna have to wait in the dressing room. E. Whatever. Do you want to go and wait in the dressing room? Hmm? Mm. No. No what? No. Thank you. Okay. And sit up straight. You're ruining my shot. That's 10 seconds, everybody. No co. Fucking right, no co. What's that? What's, what's no co? What's no Bring in five, hey. four, three. Welcome back. For our final segment tonight, Stacey and I are delighted to be joined by Heat Rash. <laughs> Their new album, Girls and Why We Love Them All, comes out this weekend. So, let me see if I can get this right. It Nolan. I write the songs. Ronnie. So it stays on my tattoo. Oh, you got a tattoo of your name on <laughs> yourself. Okay. In case he forgets it. <laughs> <laughs> this raconteur, you must be Chinny. <laughs> Why do they call you Chinny? Uh, it's because of this ugly old thing. Oh, I don't know what you mean. Oh, God, you're so fucking embarrassing. Mm. Dale. Crikey, Dale, you do not look old enough to be in a band. I get that a lot. <laughs> I'm actually 23, the oldest one. Oh. I have a growth disorder. God, I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know that. It's so cool, Preeti. Ah, it's only messing with you. It's actually 58. Yeah. <laughs> okay, right, I see. Nossa, You're going to be a happy boy. I can't put it rapidly with the camera, otherwise it's going to be a Hmm, what does TP stand for? <coughs> Tiny prick. <laughs> it stands for team player. I see. How long have you had that nickname? Ever since Nolan decided Terry Pronos was a shit name for a member of a boy band. <laughs> No co, Ronnie. Yeah, no co, Ronnie. No co. Sorry, what does no co mean? Ah, it's the opposite of no co. Ah, fuck's sake. Soco. Yeah, so cohesive. <laughs> you pretties say cool. Right, okay, thank you, Stacey. <laughs> Sorry about her. Not your fault, she's uneven. So, you guys met through a popular show on one of our rival channels, didn't you? Yeah, team players with a Z. <laughs> so, how did that work then? Well, actually, Dale and I knew each other from school. We were actually classmates and... For fuck's sake, Nolan, mate. Give someone else a chance. We all went on team players. We all auditioned. Mm -hmm. The judges put us into bands. And, um, yeah, we went to their houses and they just put us into bands. Okay. It's an example of how we're greater than the sum of our parts when we work in harmony. Uh -huh. And occasionally singing in. <laughs> So every week on the show, they get these bands and uh, they give them a song that the producer just found from under the bin somewhere. Actually, I pop. write the song. And um, the public would phone in and decide which song they like best. Right, and then uh, the losers would be eliminated. <sighs> yeah. Mom, what? No co, pretty, so no co. The band who get the most approval gets to play their song again. Sure. Uh, so, so what happens to the losers then? Mum! What? What? What do I keep doing wrong? We don't use the L word anymore. They don't say perdedores. Can you please stop saying that? Can you stop saying that? That word is a pejorative. It's a word designed to diminish. At Go Getters I learned very early that we only win when everybody wins. <laughs> Sorry, that's just, that's not real life, is it? That's just a sport. No? Sporty ball. Yeah, I, I am. I am so good. Nah, you're a shrinker. Can't be friends with shrinkers. She doesn't know what you're talking about. She doesn't understand. Uh, so I do understand, actually, Stacey. What's a shrinker? Well, a shrink, a shrinker. What's is... a pretty, Mum? I well, I think it means someone who's older, pretty doesn't it? Pretty territories. It's someone who turned 18 before the new future. Oh. We call you preties. Uneven. Mimi's. Nonks. It's not her fault. She's old. She can't <laughs> help it. I'm Oh, I'm trying actually. to help you here. Well, I don't think I need your help. See? Total Mimi. Is that so? Yes, obviously. Mano, é um negócio inteiro sobre palinhas. Muito bom, mano. You know what the real problem with you lot is? You just can't get over the fact that your beloved disrupt 
are gone and you just don't fit in anymore. Mm. But the truth is, Disrupt were violent, no-co, fricks being led by a fucking psycho. I'm glad they lost and you should be too. Listen, not everyone over 30 supported Disrupt Stacey. Not everyone, mm. no, but one fuck off lot of you did. So co, Stacey. So co. Wow. We've all learned maybe a little bit more than we expected to there. <laughs> I'm genuinely delighted to have met Heat Rash. And before we end the show tonight, I think you're going to sing for us, aren't you? I hear yes, music. Right. We're going to sing a song from Girls and Why We Love Them All. I hear Garotas, todas lindas. It's about a real relationship I have with an actual girl. Oh, no one, give it a rest, mate. No one cares. Come on, let's get on these stools, lads. Right. <laughs> Deba. So, um. Stacey. <laughs> Can I get your contact? Oh, 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 she's <laughs> 15. Go on, piss off and sing your song, Terry. Yeah. Christ. Right you are. So, here they are with their latest single, Pieces of My Heart. Are you excited, Stacey? Hi, Mara Not Garumi. for me, no. Love me, Miss Kabo, man. I music, music and a bit of jizz core. Pop Goes music. Oh, yes. I know I meant to mention this earlier. Apparently, these newfangled boy bands change singer all the bloody time. Try and follow along, eh? Keep the shot on whoever is currently singing the lead vocal. I saw you standing by the man you sent away with a brand new pair of lacquers, baby. Do you remember? of the pieces of my heart We wandered into a bush and grabbed a vodka and stank Took our assets and our wealth and drew them out of the bag I gave you little pieces of my heart Bye. Bye. You snatch me inside. 
Agora que eu entendi, mano, o que tá falando sobre o Neil, mano? Não sabia. Best of luck, thank you for coming in. Now it's almost time for final thoughts tonight. And I've actually asked Stacy to write a few, and they're just being programmed onto the auto queue now. Uh, now, I, I have no idea what she's going to say. <laughs> so, fingers on that bleep button in the broadcast room, just in case. Um, <laughs> tá bom, obrigado. Pode pode deixar. Pode deixar que eu vá. Take it away, Stacy. <laughs> My name is Stacy. I guess you know that. Ah, meu Deus do céu. Don't know why I put that in there. Anyway, I don't watch the news. There's no need. You hear all the important stuff from your mates, ah, meu Deus, so ah. I don't know what's considered important anymore. But I'm pretty sure that it's not rehashed movies and fucking boy bands, so... Anyway, I'm going to talk about what's important to me. Porra, são duas coisas ao mesmo tempo, quase. Ainda bem que para um para fazer o outro. I was nine, and in a home. Not a family home, like you call a home. This was a state children's home. It was, well, it was fucking awful, actually. It was like a Charles Dickens. Caralho, foram os dois ao mesmo tempo. Que porra, mano. The food was bad. Drugs and alcohol were everywhere. No one. Caralho. You had to watch your back. Mano, pera. Eu sou um só. And yes, as you'd imagine, there was a lot of some bad stuff. Went down there with some of the staff. Okay. Tô roubando, tô roubando. Relaxa, relaxa, relaxa. Todo mundo veste legal. And they didn't stop it. And then, Advance won the election. And like a miracle, things started to change. They got better. They had nicer food. The home was not just repaired, but redecorated and kitted out with books and sports stuff and musical instruments and video games. Most of the staff were fired, and the new ones, which there were more of, spent time talking to the bullies. And you know what? A second miracle. It worked. The bullying stopped. Life, my life, got better. Because finally, there was enough money to do the good things, and Advance had the guts to do it. I joined Go Getters, and on Liberation Night, that gave me a group of friends that I could talk Nossa, with. Tá falando, the went off and the power went out. Another miracle. I wasn't alone anymore. And that was the night I finally understood porra. the importance of being in a team. So here's my final thought. I know the people who were doing better under the old system long to go back. You say, we were freer. But what you mean is, we were richer. But for every one of you, there is a hundred of me. And even now, after all you've had, take it away. You are still doing better than I am, than I likely ever will. You still have homes of your own and families of your own who love you. And I'll never have that. So maybe you should stop looking for the worst interpretation of everything this amazing government does and realize it's not for you. It's for the millions like me. And you can cry and bleat all you want, but you're never going to get your money back because it's already been spent. On miracles. Eita! Stand by. Stand by. Let's keep making tomorrow better. And we're out. Caralho! Eles estão de volta! São eles, são eles, mano! Eles ainda existem depois de tanto tempo, caralho! Aguardem, aguardem, mano! 
if that's okay. Of course, Miss Wolfe. Security will be standing by. So they're always there then. Uh, there was a, a thing a few years ago now. Oh, with that Jeremy bloke. No, I heard no, about that. Jeremy. Are you here back then? Doesn't look old enough. She's growing on me. Yeah, she does that. A mais. Continuar. Transmissão concluída. C A a mais, mano. Nota A. Foi bom, foi bom pra caralho. A mais gostosa, eu. A de Aê mandou pra cacete, boa. Ah, mais! Ah, mano, nem o maluco, velho. As ações estão ali. Só que não subiu nem desceu, porque não tinha nenhum comercial pra colocar hoje, mano. Não tinha nenhum. Aí, boa, caralho! Subiu porque eu coloquei. Isso, isso, isso. Vamos ver, vamos ver agora... Vamos ver o programa de hoje. There's just time for a look at what's coming up later tonight on Channel One. Vamos ver o que vai passar hoje, gente. It's local programming with what's traipsing through your territory. At 7:30, it's movie time with Oh God, it's Triplets, a harrowing drama about a family cursed with financial ruin and emotional collapse after the birth of their unexpectedly mad son. At 9:15, it's What Music Is Best, a rundown of the top-selling songs across the territories. Expect catchy tunes and scenes of an inappropriately cenas sexualmente inapropriadas. Sexual nature, not one to miss. Eu quero muito ver esse programa, mano. It's time for Julia's diary. Ah, eu adoro o diário da Julia. Ever popular prime minister reads extracts from her diary in front of a warm fire. Ela lê o próprio diário na frente de uma lareira, mano. A primeira ministra tem um programa onde ela lê o diário dela na frente de uma lareira. Then at 10:30, it's the latest episode of our drama series *Betterment*, Melhoria. which tells the inspirational story of Emily Dennis. Mano, é tudo programa sobre ela, velho. Como ela tá boa e legal, caralho. And the brave doctors and technicians struggling to help her shed her old habits and adjust to the new future. Strong language and themes of selfishness there. So <laughs> not one for the kids. Incisors is at 11:15, and Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be looking back on Liberation Day by talking to several eyewitnesses and asking, "How did it all go so right?" That's followed by the Territory Weather Report, Advance Briefing, and pages from Terrytext, now featuring up to 16 simultaneous colors. What a time to be alive! But first, time to put on your thinking glasses as we go over Aí, to Megan and the team at the NNN. N, N, N. Gente, eu vou só fazer um pipinho e a gente assiste esse programão aí. Já volto, é rapidinho. Pra quem quer ver o começo do jogo, gente, tem lá no YouTube. Lá no YouTube tem todo o jogo. Todinho, todinho. Vamos lá, vamos assistir esse programinha. Good evening and welcome to the NNN. I'm Megan Wolf. And who's 
this you might be wondering. <laughs> well, it's Bring Your Daughter to Work Day here at Channel One. Yeah, so I'm joined tonight by my foster daughter, Stacey. Say hello, Stacey. Go <laughs> yourself. <laughs> All right then, here are the stories that matter to you. <laughs> First up, with advance confirming that the nuclear fallout from the 20-week war is to blame for the drop Boy, in birth rates across the territories, we asked you what keeps you going. I know that I for one was quite deflated when I heard about this, but reading all your submissions has really put the smile back on my face. This is from Sonia in Larkfordshire. I've had plenty of time to fill, so I've started a new hobby. Since I started knitting, I barely remember that 85% of the country is sterile. My record is... 85%? Que? 85% da nação tá estéreo? Mano! É a radioatividade, deve ser uns negócios assim. Não é à toa que lá atrás estava tendo... Uh, não tem mais criança. Lá atrás não. Acho que é perto do dia que a gente veio trabalhar aqui. Que a minha esposa... A esposa do Alex, no caso... É, não tinha mais criança... Indo na escola. Por isso que ela perdeu o emprego. Porque ela não tinha mais criança. Ela é educadora infantil e não, não tinha mais criança para ela ensinar. Então ela perdeu o emprego. Caralho, mano... This scarf. It's 124 meters long. Cachecol. Thank you for that. Foda. And if you've started a new hobby, do write in and tell us about it. Next up, you know how we love your uncanny, comestible coincidences. And I don't know about you, but I think this one really takes the biscuit. <laughs> I'm not sure what I'm more impressed by, Stacey. The things our viewers spot are the unbelievable way our menu centers are now able to feed every team member every single day. Greg from Coddington has sent us this lovely photo of their breakfast saying, I couldn't bring myself to eat my toast this morning because I could swear it bore the spitting image of the great Julia Salisbury's relatable face. So I had to make do with a plate of butter and two spoonfuls of jam. <laughs> do keep those coming in. Come on, here we go. Uh, we've just got time for one more of your stories and this one is an inspiring story of rehabilitation. That's it, just tell us who it's from. Yeah, and then read it out. Okay. Um, so this one says it's from John in Stokely. Before I was convicted, I'd never read a single book. But since I was released from Betterman, I haven't been able to stop. I'm even working at a library and on my lunch break, <laughs> Mr. Wordyworth spell checks for my tattoos. <laughs> we, ab we absolutely love hearing the way our neighbours and team members have been able to Tá ficando mais baixo do conforme vai passando. Essa música é muito alta, mano. Foda. First up tonight on the NNN, it's time to celebrate this week's team lottery winners live from the Shakespeare Theatre right here in the capital. We're going to hand over to Julia Salisbury. I suppose you don't think much of her either, eh, Stacey? <laughs> The new wankers. <laughs> okay. Surprising vote of approval there from Stacey. Let's go live to that right now. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. Oh, and welcome you, to this week's team awards. Hey, you don't have any one. You don't have any applause. have as team leader, this is by far the most pleasant. Thank you. As I so often say to you, the uneven past is now following the demise of Disrupt firmly behind us. This is the new future. And I say... Eu não vi? O que aconteceu? I have as ah, eu apertei ali sem querer. Eu apertei ali sem querer. 
<laughs> Ew. As I so often say to you, the uneven past is now following the device disrupt firmly behind us. This is the new future. And I say to you, it's better now. <laughs> I am delighted to be joined here tonight by one of the oldest people in Territory One. He was born over 107 years ago. Please give a warm team welcome to Alfie Touch Badger. <laughs> So, Alfie, you must have seen so much in your lifetime. What have been some of the highlights? Alfie? Is he all right? <laughs> His hearing aid isn't turned on. Oh, could you turn it on? <laughs> says it drains the battery. Well, uh, will you tell him that we'll buy him a brand new battery <laughs> after the presentation? <laughs> yeah, he says that's fine then. Tuliga. And I will, I will help him with that, yeah. <laughs> if you would. <laughs> Got I'm sorry, can't get the staff. <laughs> yeah. okay, we got it. Hello, Alfie. What? You're 107 years old. Oh, don't bloody remind me. <laughs> Would you like to tell the audience what that's like? Oh, where is everybody? Um, out there, in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bless him, it's not just the ears. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, two sugars, please. Oh, well. I'm Julia Salisbury, the Prime Minister. A likely story. Who are you really? No, no, I, I really am the Prime Minister. Oh, oh so you're a, a, a you know... A, a woman. A, yeah, a woman. One, one of Women them. can do anything men can do these days, Alfie. Oh, can you piss standing up? <laughs> I can't say I've ever tried. No, I didn't think so. Two sugars, please, and not too much milk. Uh, shall we get to the awards, Alfie? Oh, aren't you going to ask me about my life? Well, I'm not sure we have enough time left now for that, so... When I was nine, I wanted a pet, so I asked me mum and pap. There was no television then, back then, you know. We made our own to entertainment out of coal and roadkill. Well, that's... With a mortgage. So they got me a pet, see? But it weren't a dog. They told me it were a dog, but it were a stone. A stone? <gasps> yes. So I called it Patch, which hey, was a popular man. name for a dog back then, on account of the king having a patchy face. And I decided to introduce him to pretty little Gertie Thimble, who lived up the road. Oh, how romantic. <laughs> she threw my dog in the river. That was the day I decided I'd never marry. <laughs> and that's the secret to your long life? Oh no, I've been married seven times, divorced eight. There was a mix up with number three, see? <laughs> Guess I'm just lucky. <laughs> Where? Are we going back to the old soon? Uh, soon, Alfie. First, let's turn to the reason we're all here the weekly Territory One Team Awards. <laughs> First up tonight is a lady who really knows how to put in the extra hours. She works at a transition centre in Hamble Bamblebury and she has single-handedly allowed more families to unburden each other than any other nurse in Territory One. <laughs> in the past, she'd have been locked up. <laughs> tonight she <laughs> is okay, honor, as a team player. Please welcome Daphne Snister. Hey. Ah, não teve aplauso, é verdade, não tem. Uh, are you here to change, please? Just, uh, give her a medal, Você veio me trocar. Oh, got you. I mean, two sugars, please. Uh, and don't let it steep too long. I think you're supposed to give me one of those. Oh. Oh. Ah. O velho tá quebrando, mano. There he goes, look. <laughs> 
Ele não consegue. Centro de transição não é matador de idoso? Então, não sei, mano. Nesse futuro distópico, pode ser que seja. Well done. Daphne Smith to everybody. Now, open your envelope and find out what you've won. Crikey, don't hold back there. Ela mata uns idosos. She's one of Peter's homemade Eccles cakes. Got it. Hmm. I've won a holiday for two in Territory 15. It used to be called San Palmarino, didn't it? Uh, I believe it did. Yes. Why couldn't we have f***ed with that then? It's easier to remember. We're all one nation now. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Isn't it still on fire? And Daphne Snister, everyone. <laughs> oh, what about my change? I've been in these white for three days. Oh. I don't know if I'm going to get that, Alfie. All right, you are, love. Uh, next up tonight is a couple from Farnley who, after a rocky start losing their family's ill-gotten gains to the Assets and Wealth Act, have really embraced the new future. Setting up a community farm. Eu quero ver, mano, eu quero... é a mulher pelada agora, a mulher pelada. Mais 18, mais 18, mais 18. Jackson Randy Gannett. Alfie. You know, when I was in the trenches, I had a pal called Scotty Wilson. He was from way up north, so I didn't understand a bloody word he said. But he were my best mate. Should we just grab them for ourselves? Probably for the best. <laughs> <laughs> and his best mate was Smudger Ace. There was them two. Fiddly Eric, Unstable Terry, That's and of course, genius. Leggy C. <sighs> she were a girl. But she had a boy's name, so they shipped her to the front anyway. <laughs> First girl any of us has ever seen, Co's Hut. She's dead now. They all are. Smudger and Scotty never made it home. Fiddly got shanked in Frankworth prison in argument over an olive. Uma das primeiras coisas que eles introduziram. Ah, eu não lembro. É uma coisa muito velha, mas então é matador de idoso mesmo. Scratch yourself to death. Makes you think. Thanks. Make you think. Great contribution. So, Otho and Lavinia, a petting zoo. After we lost all our wealth, well, we discovered there were actually people who had never even owned a pony. I used to have three. <laughs> so we decided to do something about it. Uh, that's the type of people we are, you see. Advantage of a private education, probably. Well, I'm sure we could debate that all night, but there's no time. So, let's see what you've won. Yes, but before we do, there's something I wanted to say to you. Oh, absolutely. Every citizen of the new future has my ear. Good. When advance came to power, you took all of our wealth. You took the shirts off of our backs. Quite literally, in my case, I used to collect shirts. <laughs> well, you might as well have the rest of it too. Oh, <laughs> my Jesuito. We want our money back. One, my love. One wild. One free. Oh, oh, oh. I will keep Padge better. Uh, and you are. Oh, no. It isn't right and it isn't fair. You tell him, girl. That's my wife, you know. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. You can't make a pearls with swine. It isn't right. We used to have three horses, then did the vessel and hung well. And now what have we got? Two mangy goats, one mongrel dog called Kenneth, and a rooster that won't bloody shut up! Can we get this over quickly with, please? As the actress said to the bishop. <laughs> oh, here we go again. Uh, hello, Alfie Tadge Badger. In peace to me. <laughs> Stop them! <laughs> oh, don't worry, love. I'll protect you. Oh, 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 oh. oh. He's even better dwell than what he knows. You know. This reminds me of when I was in my twenties and we go to the, the promenade at Shining on Sea and watch all the pretty girls on the beach. <laughs> Everything was black and white then, of course. 
we visit the Penny Arcade and try to win a block of lard to take home for the family. You couldn't buy lard in those days. You had to win it. Oh, it was so much simpler back then. Boys were boys, girls were girls. Everyone else was recruited by the circuses. <laughs> there were loads of them, you see, circuses, with their big tents and their candy floss. You hear the music, the pipe organ, drifting over the nearby fields. <laughs> My mum used to call it the most magical sound in the world. This was before she lost her hearing after giving a particularly loud round of applause. <laughs> yeah, yeah, did. Oh, did, did you ever go to the circus? What's that, Alfie? Uh, the circus. Uh, oh, never mind. Yeah, <laughs> just a tea pack. Well, that was an unexpected dose of naked nostalgia. <laughs> Some people simply can't let go of the past. That's why I look in joy and fervent admiration at the younger generation. So cohesive, such a team. And with fertility falling throughout the territories, we should value our fabulous new generation now more than ever. Our final winner tonight is a go-getter who really went and got him, helping to root out more than 170 disrupt collaborators in his own neighborhood. Caralho, que isso? Since then, he's gone on to be a senior cohesion cadet leader and organized all of the entertainment at last year's camp cooperation. Por isso que ele é tão estranho, Our mano. Final winner tonight, ele é loucaço, mano. Ele é todo louco. Oh, you should be in a transition centre, you old nonk. Olá. Prime Minister. Yeah, it's an absolute pleasure to finally meet you. Ele é todo loucão. We're very similar, in my opinion. Oh, well, I've never been much of a role model. <laughs> Love it. Prime Minister, you have saved this country. You have fought enemies, foreign and domestic, with an iron fist. As with my own tiny fists have I. Well, let's open the envelope and find out what you've won. <laughs> Maybe it'll be a fist enlargement. <laughs> a year's internship as a behaviour coach at Betterment. It's just what I've always wanted. Let's show the fools where they went wrong, eh? Well, actually, Betterment is about rehabilitation, Edwin. Absolutely. And if they don't reintegrate, we retaliate, just like you did on Liberation Night. Thank you mm -hmm. for this award, and stay vigilant. Report the non-cohesives. Be a team player. That concludes tonight's awards. Uh, join me next Look week when us. hopefully things will be a lot more normal. Back to you, Megan. Prime Minister Salisbury there at a highly eventful team award ceremony. Any thoughts on this week's winners, Stacey? The nurse was fucking scary. Yeah. The pre-tees were sagging. A possible quote. We'll never lose his virginity. Okay. Well. <laughs> there, if a little profane. After the break, we'll be going live to a star-studded premiere. You won't believe who's on the red carpet tonight. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back. <laughs> Porra! É, tipo. Puta! É tipo isso. Although the fighting has long passed, the dark clouds of war still loom over our united lands. And we all know who forced our hand. Isso é comercial a favor do governo, mano. The tyrants of the world would spread their oppression to our team. Their war has denied us the right to our children. Even as they still refuse to feed their own, but they have underestimated us. For though they may have scarred our bodies, they will never damage our will or break our mutual bonds. Birth rates may be challenging, but happiness is everywhere. Satisfaction radiates from every metric. We are producing more and faster than ever before. We have more time to focus on our inner lives, for leisure, for art. We have less stress, and we are healthier than ever. Our... Ou seja, as crianças que estavam fudendo tudo, é isso, mano. As crianças que fodem tudo, mano. As crianças, ter filho, 
É óbvio que eles estão mais felizes. Ninguém tá tendo filho, mano. É óbvio, porra. In future, it's secure. We are strong together as a community, a team, safe from the divisive despots beyond our borders for whom cohesiveness is an alien concept. Every day, across these territories, neighbors support neighbors and friends reach out to friends, strengthening and protecting each other through cooperation, through unity, as one. Advance. Always. Together. Welcome back. Stacy's still here. Wishing she wasn't. Thanks, Stacy. And in this segment, we're delighted to have sent Robin and Patrick to the movies. Ah, yes. essa parte eu Tonight não vi nada, mano. Tonight is the world premiere mano. of The Automated, starring Lawrence Blunderclatch and the late great Helena Canterbury Boatshu. And all the stars are out tonight. Mano, são os We first todo. covered this film almost five years ah, ago, era esse back when mesmo. it was called The Medicated. Era o medicado antes. E agora é. Tonight is the world premiere. Automatizado. Tá. Agora é automatizado e o primeiro trailer que a gente viu era. <risos> Medicado. Ah, peraí, peraí. Falou coisa. Then, for mysterious reasons, the film was suddenly pulled the night before its release. Well, since then, executive producer George Focus has spent five long years polishing the film and turning it into a special edition and premiering tonight with extensive state-of-the-art Cinco anos arrumando o filme, mano. quality voice team, George says it's the movie Caralho. he always wanted to make. Now, let's take a look at it. Olha o trailer. Deconstructed. Robots. Is this a wig? You think I don't grow that? No, Dick, I'll kill you. Pera. <laughs> é só uma dublagem por cima do outro e com efeito por cima. Ele dublou todo o filme. E colocou efeito por cima do filme Pra... Pra conseguir relançar ele If only I'd noticed. Captain Quasar. You rested, but I didn't notice. Captain. I'm buffering, Jake, you said. I've got one on you. God damn it, lost it all. Here's a map. What's a map? Okay, so head north on Interstellar Avenue, left at the asteroid belt, and a tricky three-point turn at Uranus. What are these symbols? This corner, this, this is the key. We could shut it down. Yes, yes, we could shut it down. Meu Deus do céu, ele só trocou todo o negócio. Isso tá muito ruim. But we have to ask ourselves. Who are we? Mano, é completamente outra coisa. Robô. Mano, ele trocou tudo. Antes era do quê? O medicado? Eu não lembro o que que era. Falaram que era de zumbi antes. E aí ele trocou pra ser de robô. Mano, que coisa... Gosh, thrilling stuff. What did you think, Stacy? The robots were all right, I guess. They certainly were. Let's go over to Robin Short now in Western Square, who I believe has got the star of the show, Robin. Well, Megan, I'm joined by not one, but both of the stars, ah. Lawrence Blunderclatch and Helena Canterbury Bochu. Thank you so much. No, thank you. It's thanks to shows like yours that Helena and I are even here. 
don't you agree? Well, I couldn't. Absolutely right, darling. <laughs> and uh, you two... Ela morreu. <risos> Ela morreu, mano. Amém, que Deus a tenha. You have both become absolutely huge in the past couple of years, haven't you? Even huger, yes, that's right. I feel very lucky, very, very lucky to be born, well, you know. And Helena is in massive demand too at the moment. She's still the face of a major cosmetics brand, and she's booked to do a one-woman Leah in the summer. Wow, it sounds like you're both very busy. Mm -hmm. But is there any chance we'll get to see you together on screen again? No, oh, no, I'm really not supposed to mention this, but yes, we are doing a little something together. No. I'm playing a weathered starship captain from another galaxy, and Helena is my droid companion. But how does that work? I spend seven hours in makeup mode. No, um, how does Helena play a droid? Oh, we just pop her on a roller skate. Wow. Well, <laughs> Lawrence Blunderclatch and Helena Canterby Boat Shoot, thank you so much for joining me. And we're going over to Patrick Bannon now. Patrick, <laughs> will we be seeing you in a movie anytime Bruno. soon? Thank you, Robin. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I'm joined here by pop icon. It's Lil C. <laughs> Lil C. And her father, <laughs> country singer and alien worshipper, Billy Bob Jean Short. Howdy. <laughs> so, Lil C, what's with the bag? Oh, Patrick, she knows oh, what she's done. <laughs> e? Well, we love this look. Is it one of yours? No, you know it's not. We don't do that anymore. Ah, uh, yes, of course, your clothing label went bankrupt, didn't it? <laughs> yes, because a certain TV show failed to fulfill their contractual obligations. <laughs> well, you look great. <laughs> oh, well, that's probably due to her new cosmetics and wellness brand. Well, I'm not sure that it is. <laughs> Let her show you. This oh. is our new eyeshadow oh. palette. She oh. calls this one Glands. Wow, it's scented. <laughs> Wow, that was a surprise. É porque eu um programa lá atrás, sim. We call this shade lips. Oh, oh, wow. Why is it so salty? It's organic. Mm. And this, our next one, this body spray. Mm. This is a body mist which rebalances your hormones <laughs> and actually smells like fertility. Oh, right. Yeah. <coughs> wow. You feel that? Yeah. Yeah, that burns. Oh. All this is part of Lil C's uh. new range, straight from my veins. Oh, good lord! Praise Craglar! Ah, uh. uh. so um, you're retiring from the music industry. That must be hard. Well, she's way past her prime, Patrick. It was very hard for her to accept at first, <laughs> but the industry is very, very sure about these things. <laughs> well, you sure we can't convince you to release just one last album? <laughs> We do actually have another album ready, but that's for the label to release in case she dies over the next 10 years or so. Oh, oh really? <laughs> well, given the way she's going, you might get it by Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we better let you get back. <laughs> oh, now, oh. now remember, we need the money. So, she's also available for parties, <laughs> weddings, funerals, and bar mitzvahs. Well, thank you. We'll see. That's <laughs> we'll see there. Oh. <laughs> oh, and it looks like Robin has got hold of Jesus. <laughs> is it obvious I'm sweating? Yes! It? it absolutely is, Patrick. Jesus, I almost can't believe you're here. How have you been? You know, I like to walk amongst the peoples every now and then. It makes them feel close to me. Right, yes. And to be close is to be human. And to be human to be a part. Oh, that was good, write that down. Hey, Rachel, write that one down. <laughs> it's good to see you've done so well for yourself. Thank you, my child. You know, I have you to thank for that. If it was never for your show supporting me and my music, I never would have transcended. 
Now, there are rumours going around that you might be running for office. Is there any truth to that? Yeah, 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 that's absolutely true, yeah. But you're aware that elections have been suspended in the territories? Uh, no, I'm, I'm not running to be no prime minister. Oh, you're not? No. I'm going to be king of the moon. <laughs> King of the Moon? Yes. No, sorry. You're running for King of the Moon? No, not running. It's my birthright. Ah, and does this have anything to do with promoting your upcoming hip opera, Jason Space? Hush now. Sinister is so on moon. Ah, OK. And how long will this last? Will it go the way of last year's Living as a mouse fiasco, or maybe your foray into ventriloquist beats. I don't make the moon rules, I merely live by them. <laughs> so, are you looking forward to seeing the automated? You know, I don't believe in film. Thou shalt keep thine image still and holy. That's track for Jesus Christ made us though. Okay. Thank you for your time and good luck with your new life <laughs> in space. I'm with you, my child. <laughs> well, Megan, that's what success looks like. I'm going to see if we can grab someone else to have a chat. Back to you. Thanks, Robin. But I think Stacey and I are probably in quite enough trouble where we are. So. Three big names there, Stacey. Yeah, big names. Any thoughts about them? Maybe from your generation's perspective? You won't like my opinions. Oh, go on, try me. <laughs> <laughs> well, Bumbanonk is so old he's like one week away from a transition centre, so who cares? And Lilsi was cool when I was like 12 or something, oh, but now God, she's still a loony. And Jesus is a disrupt loving <laughs> should have died with the rest of them three years ago. <laughs> You're right. You agree with me? No, you're right, I don't like your opinions. Mm. But thankfully, we can go back to Patrick now, <laughs> who has another familiar face to catch up with. Oh, Patrick, what's the atmosphere like there? <laughs> it's absolutely electric, Megan. I can't quite believe it either, but he's here. It's Crazy Neil. Hey. Hi. Oh, how you doing? <laughs> Neil, our audiences just love you. They've really, really connected with your ads over the years. What's it like suddenly being so popular? It's crazy. <laughs> People stop me in the streets. They expose themselves. They write me threatening letters. You know, <laughs> the stalker has become the stalky. <laughs> A real taste of Neil's own medicine, if you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah. Hey. And, and what's been the most challenging thing about well, being so famous? It's places like this. You know, being around actors and rock stars, they're real crazy. And Crazy Neil knows crazy. <laughs> and I'm used to being the loudest whack job in the room. Hey. Yes, I can imagine. <laughs> but I know what you're thinking. Hey, Neil, where's the crazy deal? <laughs> love I, love I, bro. <laughs> we got crazy deals on chairs. You ever sit in a chair to knock your socks off? No, I can't say that I have. Makes a mess of the carpet. But what do you say? We got a deal? Uh, well. Well, what about Betty Andrews' handbag? <laughs> it's real leather, it's real cheap. And it even contains our heart medicine. <laughs> Spicy. Uh, no, really. I You've got the chair. Cold. You've got the bag. You're really busting my balls. What can I do to convince you? Oh. Let me throw in my wife. <laughs> Mrs. Neil. Oh, yeah. It's the latest model. Not a scratch on her. Pearls like a charm. What do you say? Have we got a deal. Look, I, I really I can't take your wife. Yes, you can. I got loads of them. <laughs> oh. Come on down to crazy deals. <laughs> we got crazy deals on chairs. We got crazy deals on meals. <laughs> we got crazy deals on wheels. <laughs> we got wheels on meals. Meals on wheels. We've even got endangered seals. And we got meals with endangered seals. <laughs> yeah! But I don't know. Velho. Well, it's always a é tudo um dream take come só, true to be a hero. How about that, Megan? The man himself. Aren't we lucky? <laughs> Back to you. Mano, um take só, velho. E tudo... Mano, muito bom. Muito bom. <laughs> Thanks, Patrick. What a colourful uh, interview there on what looks like an amazing night. They certainly know how to make an entrance. 
I hope. And the automated really does seem to have unstoppable written all over it because despite Boris Horsey in Hours magazine calling it Lawrence Blunderclatch's overly long suicide note, in a review which ends with the words, and he hasn't even had the decency to see it through, the film, which is free to all residents of the territories, has seen record pre-bookings and looks set to run for months and months. But Let's go back to those lucky few seeing it tonight. Oh, I'm so jealous. Robin, you seen anything unusual there? Well, oh, I boy. thought I saw some leprechauns in the green room, but I think it might have been someone's kids. <laughs> but I know, they just keep coming. And here are some more famous faces, or famous brains, I suppose. It's Dr. David Wong and Dr. Ingrid is also here. Oh, no. We have I'm been following, following your plight so closely on our show over the last few years. What's it like to be back on dry land? It's so wonderful. I'm still not used to it. Every time I see the sun, I want to just scream out in joy. <laughs> I'm grateful every day to your viewers for their support. Without them, well, we wouldn't be here. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. And am I right in thinking that you two have a lovely little boy together? Dante's three now, and he's gorgeous. Oh, what a beautiful family. Not since she left me. Oh, oh excuse me, I, I, I didn't mean to... Um... It's fine. <laughs> oh, it's fine, is it? Well, what happened? Well, you know, the normal story. Sometimes things aren't as easy as they were when all you had was a key. Uh, no sooner was she able to see me in daylight than she was zooming off with a moron. Oh, she's not a moron. She's a doctor. A dermatologist is not a doctor. So sorry about this. That's fine. I'm sure she's got lovely skin. But forgive me if I don't ask her to do a coronary artery bypass. If you carry on eating those pies, you might have to. <laughs> Here we go again. Yeah? Very good. We can't all have pores as clean as hers, can we? At least she doesn't have a PhD in biomechanics. You take that back. Well, thanks to you both. <laughs> for pushing the boundaries of human so knowledge. Crikey! Well, the movie's about to start, so Patrick and I are about to share a box of overpriced popcorn. Back to you, Megan. Thanks, Robin. Lucky you, and enjoy the movie. The Automated opens in cinemas across the territories this weekend. What a star-studded event, eh, Stacey? Who cares? No one goes to the cinema these days. Of course. We'll be back after these messages. Songs of the new future. Love him. Stefano Arrivederci. Falando o cara que morre. Lil D. Ralá, Enemy Soldier, mano. Enemy Soldier foda, moleque. Essa era foda, essa era foda. Eu queria ouvir a versão completa das músicas que a gente escutou aqui.
Welcome back. For our final segment tonight, Stacy and I are delighted to be joined <laughs> by Heat Rash. Their new album, Girls Urticaria. and Love Mano, them all, comes out this weekend. So, let me see if I can get this right. It's Nolan. I write the songs Ronnie. for... Ronnie. That's what he says on my tattoo. Oh, you've got a tattoo of your name on yourself. Okay. In case he forgets it. <laughs> <laughs> this raconteur, you must be Chinny. Sup? <laughs> Why do they call you Chinny? Uh, it's because of this ugly old thing. Oh, I don't know what you mean. Oh, God, you're so embarrassing. Mm. Dale. Crikey, Dale, you do not look old enough to be in a band. I get that a lot. I'm actually 23, the oldest one. I have a growth disorder. You know, my so sorry, I, I didn't know that. It's so cool, Pete. Oh, it's only messing with you. He's actually 58. <laughs> <laughs> OK, right, I see. You're going to be a handful, aren't you, oh, boys? Mum. <laughs> and you must be TP. Hmm, what does TP stand for? <laughs> it stands for team player. I see. How long have you had that nickname? Ever since Nolan decided Terry Pronos was a name for a member of a boy band. Bolaling. <laughs> no co, Ronnie. Yeah, no co, Ronnie. No co. Sorry, what does no co mean? Oh, no co, yeah. It's the opposite of Soko. Ah. Take Soko. Yeah. So cohesive. Coesive. You pre say cool. Right, okay. Thank you, Stacey. <laughs> Sorry about her. Not your fault. She's uneven. So, you guys met through a popular show on one of our rival channels, didn't you? Yeah, Team Players with a Z. <laughs> so, how did that work then? <laughs> well, actually, Dale and I knew each other from school. We were actually classmates. For <laughs> sake, Nolan, mate. Give someone else a chance. We all went on Team Players. We all auditioned. Mm -hmm. The judges put us into bands. And, um, yeah, we went to their houses and they just put us into bands. Yeah. It's an example of how we're greater than the sum of our parts when we work in harmony. Uh -huh. And occasionally singing it. <laughs> So every week on the show, they get these Essas fans, uh, jovens, man. song that the producer just found from under the bin somewhere. Actually, I thought. write the song. And um, the public would phone in and decide which song they like best. Right, and then uh, the losers would be eliminated. He used the word, man. Mom, what? No co. Pretty. So no co. The band who get the most approval get to play their song again. Sure. Uh, so what happens to the losers then? <laughs> Mum. What? Ah, we don't use the L word anymore. What you mean, losers? Would you please stop saying that? That word is a pejorative. That word is a pejorative. It's a word designed to diminish. At Go Getters, I learned very early that we only win when everybody wins. But, mm. sorry, that's just, that's not real life, is it? That's just sports board, no? Yellow. I thought you were Soko. Yeah, I, I am, I am Soko. Nah, you're a shrinker. Can't be friends with Shrinker. She's not talking about. She doesn't understand. Um, so I do understand, actually, Stacey. What's a shrinker? Well, a shrink, a shrinker. What's is... a pretty, Mum? I well, I think it means someone who's older, pre doesn't it? Pre territories. It's someone who turned eighteen before the new future. Mm. We call you preties. Uneven. Mimi. Nonks. It's not her fault. She's old. She can't help it. I'm not that old. I'm trying actually. to help you here. Well, I don't think I need your help. See? Total Mimi. Is that so? Yes, obviously. <laughs> <clears throat> you know what the real problem with you lot is? You just can't get over the fact that your beloved disrupt are gone and you just don't fit in anymore. Yes, you keep being like a Disrupt were violent, no co <laughs> being led by <laughs> psycho. Say keep being so say keep being someone. Not everyone over 30 supported disrupt state. Not everyone, no. But what <laughs> off lot of you did. So co Stacy. <risos> Mano, o foda é que aqui, aqui a gente tá trocando de câmera, porque eu fiquei trocando. Mas é um take só, sempre. Tudo isso aqui foi um take só. Eles não riram no meio. É um take só tudo. Aqui eu fico trocando de câmera. Mas é, eles são muito bons, mano. Eles não quebram. É muito doideira isso. Eu só tô trocando de câmera, mas é sempre um take só. We've all learned maybe a little bit more than we expected to there. <risos> 
I'm genuinely delighted to have met Heat Rash. And before we end the show tonight, I think you're going to sing for us, aren't you? Yes, that's right. We're going to sing a song from Girls and Why We Love Them All called Pieces of My Heart. <laughs> oh, I can leave. Oh, which is about a real relationship I have with an actual girl. Oh, no one, give it a rest, mate. No one cares. Come on, let's get on these stools, lads. Right. <laughs> So, um, <laughs> Stacey, can I get your contact? Oh, 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 she's 15. Go uh, and sing your song, Terry. Yeah. Christ. Right you are. <laughs> <laughs> so, here they are with their latest single, Pieces of My Heart. Are you excited, Stacey? Not for me, no. I only listen to blip music and a bit of jizz core. Pop music is... Que que gozo cor e blip? Que que são? <risos> mano, um gozo cor eu, eu escutaria muito fácil, mano, muito fácil, velho. Okay. <risos> Not for me, no. I only listen to blip music and a bit of jizz cor. Jizz cor é em inglês também chama gozo cor. Jizz cor. Mano. <risos> Pop music is Okay. Here they are. It's Heat Rash. Urticaria. Ronnie, Vamos ver essa música aí, mano. TP, Dale and Nolan. Heat Rash. Blip, Blip deve ser uma banda, sei lá. <risos> Tem legenda pra gente. Queixudinho, é muito bom o nome dele. I saw you standing by the man you sent on with a brand new pair of flackers, baby, do you? Doado? Tá, eu espero, eu espero. Não 
música foi gra gravada sem corte também, tudo em take só. Dá pra ver a câmera se mexendo pro você... Não, é tudo. Toda vez que é, que é um, um quadro, é, é um take só. Todos eles. Todos eles é um take só. Magnus Cristax comprovado. Vamos lá. É tudo um take só sempre, mano. É muito foda, velho. Modo extra? O que é o modo extra? O que eu me importo mais com esse jogo é a história. Se não for coisa com a história, eu não sei não se eu jogaria não, mano. Eu vi que tem uns modos extra aí que é mais difícil e tal. Mas eu quero ver a história mesmo. Ah tá, falta um pouco. Todas as coisas são 100% sem corte, sim, sim, sim. Terminou? Terminou? Tem uma transação chamada Teleton com o pai de Patrick Bannon. O que? No extra? Aí eu jogaria. Se for, uma coisa só, se for uma coisa da história, alguma coisinha assim, eu jogaria. Mas se for só, tipo, rejogar as coisas com umas coisas meio tortas, só mais difícil, aí não. Queixudinha é seu preferido. <risos> É, eu acho que a música seria a mesma Se eu não tivesse tá, colocado o Neil ou não A letra seria a mesma Porque eles, eles citam outras pessoas também oh, Wow oh, Fantastic, thank you Heat Rush That was That was actually really good <laughs> Best of luck, thank you for coming in Now it's almost time for final thoughts tonight. And e agora ela vai falar um monte de coisa, mano. Eu não tenho ideia do que ela vai dizer. Então, com os olhos no botão de bleep, apenas em caso de fingers on that bleep button in the broadcast room, just in case. Muito bom, ela falando. Take it away, Stacey. My name is Stacey. I guess you know that by now. I don't know why I put that in there. Anyway. I don't watch the news. There's no need. You hear all the important stuff from your mates, so I don't know what's considered important anymore. É isso, é isso. Ah, mano, por que, por que ver as notícias, mano? Eu converso com meus amigos, eu já sei das coisas. <laughs> But I'm pretty sure that it's not rehash movie boy bands, so... Anyway. I'm gonna talk about what's important to me. Eu sou jovem, eu sei das coisas, é, então. Elected, six years ago, I was nine and in a home. Not a family home like you call a home. This was a state children's home. It was, well, it was awful actually. It was like a Charles Dickens book. The roof leaked and the walls were damp some mornings. The food was bad. Drugs and alcohol were everywhere. No one cared. You had to watch your back all the time because there weren't enough staff to manage us. And yes, As you'd imagine, there was a lot of... Some bad stuff went down there with some of the staff, okay? Not all of them, but the others knew, and they didn't stop it. And then, Advance won the election. And like a miracle, things started to change. They got better. We had nicer food. The home was not just repaired, but redecorated and kitted out with books and sports stuff and musical instruments and video games. Most of the staff were fired and the new ones, which there were more of, spent time talking and working with the bullies. And you know what? 
a second miracle. It worked. The bullying stopped. Life, my life, got better. Because finally, there was enough money to do the good things and Advance had the guts to do it. I joined Go Getters and on Liberation Night, that gave me a group of friends that I could talk with when the bombs went off and the power went out. Another miracle. I wasn't alone anymore. And that was the night I finally understood the importance of being in a team. <laughs> so here's my final Falando thought. que ela gostou da, da bomba, tá ligado? I know the people mano. who were doing better under the old system long to go back. You say, we were freer. But what you mean is, we were richer. But for every one of you, there is a hundred of me. And even now, after all you've had, take it away, you are still doing better than I am than I likely ever will. You still have homes of your own and families of your own who love you. And I'll never have that. So maybe you should stop looking for the worst interpretation of everything this amazing government does and realize it's not for you. It's for the millions like me. Hey, you can cry and bleed all you want, but you're never gonna get your back because it's already been spent on miracles. Caramba. Aí, aí. It's now over. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by, stand by. Tomorrow, better. No signal. <laughs> the dreary days are over. Ficou meio cagado. The is far behind us. The territories are expanding with yeah, countries queuing deles, to add their forces meio cagado. to the warm symphony of the new future. It's an exciting time, but there's one thing missing, and that's where you come in. Advance are calling on talented, creative people from across the territories to submit their most stirring creations as entries in the United Territories Anthem Slam. Ah, vai ter um for a new song for the new future. Something that speaks from and to Mano, vai mudar o hino. an original composition of cooperation and cohesiveness, a song of solidarity for a steadfast society. No previous songwriting experience is required. All you need to do is record or notate your anthem and, if possible, arrange it for a modern 39 piece chamber orchestra or 44 voice choir. The entries will be judged by acclaimed composer Jonathan Williamson, responsible for the soundtracks to Bullet Man, no, I don't bullet man, man. The Automated, <gasps> I didn't and, of course, Space Opera, Parts 1, 2, and 5. <laughs> so why not put on your composing trousers, sharpen your music stick, and have a go? You can grab the friendly 31 page entry form at your nearest team offices. Advance. Because a mighty movement requires a mighty melody. É isso, gente. Agora vamos ver. Vamos pra, pra parte sem edição, gente. Vamos ver o que temos aqui. And this is Jenny. Cara. Deixa eu colocar o, o certinho aqui pra vocês. É esse aqui, né? Ah, esse aqui é o comecinho. Vamos lá. And this is Jenny. She's the floor manager. Hi, Stacey. Hmm. That's Colin. He, um... Do you know what? Just don't talk to Colin. We're getting involved in bringing your daughter to work, eh, Colin? Nah, nah, we don't believe in it. All right, come and sit next to Mum. <laughs> believe in what? Just days. Atta girl. T ten seconds, everybody. For all of them. <clears throat> Monday's a myth. I explained so much. Okay, we are going in five, four, three. <laughs> Ela é muito. Ela é muito. <laughs> Ela é muito ranzinza, mano. Caralho, velho. Ela tem... Nossa, ela é muito uma adolescente cuzona, né, mano? Ela odeia tudo, velho. Ela é jovem descolada, mano. Hoje, a cara de nojo, o default de adolescente. Adolescente padrão aqui, mano. 
<risos> Muito bom, mano. Oh, na boa, velho. O que me faz gostar tanto desse jogo é exatamente isso, mano. É... É, o pessoal é muito bom. O pessoal é muito bom em trazer umas coisas completamente aleatórias. Uns estereótipos muito específicos. E, e, e juntar essas duas coisas, sabe? O aleatório com o específico. Nossa, mano, é muito louco. Tá, vai ter muita câmera aqui pra gente ver. Vamos ver o que, que vai ter aqui. Tá carregando. Tá, deixa eu mutar dois aqui. We absolutely love hearing the way our neighbors and team members have been able to become better people. So do let us know your stories here. You can do this bit, Stacey. <laughs> no, you're all right, thanks. Oh, come on, give it a try. Essa parte a gente chegou a ver, mas vai, é que vai entrar a abertura aqui, se eu não me engano. Let us know your stories here at the NNN. NNN! Aí, eu mutei. Yeah, ecstatic. Ah, you know what? This actually used to be called the National Nightly News. Now it's just... Nobody cares. Everything all right here? You okay, Stacey? Eee. Can I get you a glass of water? Or... Good luck. Mm, kill me. Oh, sorry, I forgot my murdering kit today. Pissy. Mm. Do you want me to leave? No, Stacey, I just want you to try. Coming back from the titles, quiet in the studio. Ta. Show avançar. Porque vai ter a... vai ter isso aqui. Só que aí eu acho que elas vão falar alguma coisa logo que passar pra lá, talvez, eu não sei. Vai ter uma aprovação lá da Stacey. Vamos ir ao vivo para isso agora. Boa noite, todos, e bem-vindos a esta semana's Team Awards! Ah, peraí. Ô, oh, caralho. Eu deixei o, o errado, com o som. Aí. Eu quero ouvir uma opinião. Boa noite, todos. Oh, é bom ouvir uma opinião. Eu quero ouvir, você pode parar? Please. Stacy, if we could just oh, reduce no, no, the word we've got to shut up so that Stacy can... Including you, Mum. Caralho, ela foi adotada pela Megan e ela nem. Nossa, mano! Não sei se vai falar alguma coisa. Tem como desadotar? Eu adoro as reações, mano. Ele morreu. É a parte do velho, não tá respondendo, mano. <risos> Só de olhar o suficiente Ela já entendeu <risos> Ai, Você se percebeu lá, Mas no finalzinho lá Quando ela começa a falar que a demência é boa Ela falou que ela nunca teve uma mãe Que amava ela, uma família que gostasse dela Sendo que a Bianca tá ali Sendo super apoiadora com ela e legal Eu achei isso muito triste Então ela não liga pra mãe que, que adotou ela Ela não liga é porque ela é adolescente. Adolescente faz o quê? Não liga. Vamos ver. Lavagem cerebral. É, determinada lavagem cerebral, sim. Ela é coê. A cara da Mega, mano. Ela sent... É, mano, ela tá na posição <risos> Posição adolescente De sentar, mano <risos> Gamer Gamer barra adolescente, mano Tá aqui, pô Tá aqui, assim, ó A postura de milhões, mano Tá, eu vou pular porque 
É que eles estão reagindo a... ao que tá acontecendo lá mesmo. Mano, lembrando que não tem corte, nem aqui. Elas pararam de falar, cortou pra isso, pro, pra, pra premiação aqui, e não teve corte pra essa parte. Elas só continuaram, essa câmera continuou. E tá passando essa, isso aqui pra eles, e eles têm que reagir. Mano, é muito absurdo. É muito absurdo. Eu quero ver se fala alguma coisa mesmo. Ô oh, caralho, o que deixa eu falar do negócio? Não, aqui tá muito rápido. <risos> não vai deixar maquiar ela. Não vai, não vai. Tá rindinho, tá rindinho. Aê, palma. Eu quero ver a parte do mais 18. O que, que vai acontecer? É agora, é agora. Vai dar mais 18, vai dar mais 18. Don't prove. It's fucking Aqui, aqui, agora. For fuck's sake. Don't prove. It's fucking people don't have a right to protest. I wouldn't expect you to understand. I'm trying. You're really not such an old fuddy duddy like you think I am. Fuddy duddy. Oh, fucking says it all. Well, what would you call me then? Oh, actually, don't answer that. Let's just see how this plays out. Deu ado? Esperava, esperava, esperar. Eu aguardo, eu aguardo. Uh, brigadão G, Default, hoje em PAC. Pedro do, do Lugos, Cauados Café, G-Level, Imix, Necro, Necronomite, Legite, Cactiano, Tutu Luiz, é... oa, 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 oa. Demorei muito para perceber que estava vendo o Ado. É, era o próximo Ado. Pronto. Aí eu já, já tirei aqui. Noletob, Volvix, 6V, Paulo, Hunter, Mr. Junior Games, Fefiadori, Arto Pelta, Sou Gidraconiano, o que, que eu tô fazendo? Vitor, EGVA, Desagermelin e Icazemo. Muito obrigado pelo sub, gente. Obrigadinho, obrigadinho. Porque eu recebi Ado sendo Prime, é porque compraram Ado. Tinham comprado, tinham comprado. E aí foi. Resgataram o Ado. Volta um pouquinho. É que nem teve muita coisa. Nem, nem, nem aconteceu muita coisa. Ela tá falando das coisas lá, pela dona. <risos> ela, ela, ela mereceu, a Stacey é completamente contra, mano. Estavam batendo na mulher lá no chão. Ela até levantou.
A música sincronizou com as batidas. É o menino estranho. Ela já foi adotada várias vezes, <risos> então, mano. Tem devolução? Tem devolução, mano. Aí que vai voltar aqui. Prime Minister Salisbury there at a highly event. Tá, aí já que voltou pra cá. Deixa eu ver aqui se vai ter alguma coisa. I understand you, Prime Minister. We're very alike. If only. Peter Clement had some more of my qualities and less of his own, eh? I am nothing like you, Edward. You clearly haven't understood a thing. Uh, Prime Minister? You shouldn't be interning at Betterment. You should be being enrolled. Um, Peter Clement was my best friend. And I wouldn't have changed one thing about him. Now piss off to your mother. Mother? <laughs> Oh, two sugars. <risos> Meu Deus do céu, velho. Foi chamar a mamãe. Deixa eu ver aqui o que, que vai ter. Ah, aqui. Else in this building, in a tiny room, all by themselves is a person. Pera, aqui foi pro comercial? We'll never lose ah. his virginity. Okay. O comercial aqui, que vai pro comercial, velho. Depois break, vamos estar indo para uma premiere de uma estrela estrela. Você não vai acreditar quem está no red carpet hoje. Não vá para lugar nenhum, nós vamos voltar depois disso. E estamos fora! Você sabe, em algum lugar em este building, em um pequeno room, tudo por si mesmo, é uma pessoa chamada Alex Winston. Now, Sou eu! Sou eu! Ela está falando de mim! Ela está falando de mim! Eu realmente apreciaria se você pudesse passar por uma sentença hoje, sem fazer eles olharem para o botão de bleep cada vez que você faz. Você acha que podemos tentar isso? Alex e Winston podem se fuder eles próprios. Que isso? Vai se fuder, mano? Esse segmento me lembra dos bons velhos dias. Não, como que tudo se espalha de controle para algum tipo de desastre cômico. Sim, isso. É como ter ele de volta na cadeira. Você acha que ele está assistindo em algum lugar? Laughing. Acho que ele está. Jeremy? Are you watching us? Are you receiving us? Jeremy. Are you fucking with us? Oh, right. So she can swear. Jeremy. Oh, ele morreu? Então, ele só tá desaparecido. Mas ele tá aí, né, mano? Ele só tá aí, velho. O blip que ela falou antes era som de censura na banda mesmo. Não, acho que não, porque quando, quando eu censuro... É... É... Fica a legenda O que ela falou Então era o nome da banda Chamava Blip Mas provavelmente tem a ver com Com censura só ouço... Ela deve escutar só coisa pesada mesmo Metal pesado sei lá. Um gênero musical É então Pode ser um, um gênero musical Que fica tudo censurado <risos> E gozocore Então mano Vamos ver o próximo aqui. Gozocore é foda, mano. So, Patrick and Robin are just gonna... Calma. Aqui. Grab who they can and then you've got these generic links on the autocue to glue it all together. They do know I have a Queen's View degree in journalism. Bet you wish you'd study something useful now, eh? All this bring your daughter to work day. What a joke. Where is our honored guest? I don't know, she's probably sniffing around that boy band, Hotspot. Heat Rash. Hotspot won it last year. Heat Rash. 
Oh God, they're running out of names, aren't they? I hear the computer comes up with them, the songs too. Ah, there she is, and just in time too. That's 10 seconds, everybody. <laughs> what have you been up to? What's it to you? And we are going in five, four, Caralho, mano. three, Parece que a gente chegou já, já vemos. Ah, vai passar o trailer de automatizado. Aí, tá passando o trailer. Tá passando o trailer, gente. Posso fazer assim, ó. Pra ver os dois. Esse trailer é foda, mano. I saw the first version of this <laughs> on Pirate. We had it back at the home. It was way better. They fucking ruined it. Okay, well, I don't know. Try and find something nice to say about this one. <sighs> so you want me to lie? No, I just want you to find a palatable truth. There's a difference. Uma meia verdade. Here's a map. What's a map? Okay, so head north on Interstellar Avenue, left of the asteroid belt. Guard, guard, Shaggy, guard. What are these symbols? This corner. This, this is the key. We can shut it down. Yes, yes, we can shut it down. But we have to ask ourselves. Coming back now. Throwing to Robin first on OV with are... Wonder Cunt. Stay. Sorry, yeah. Coming back now. Throwing to Robin first on OB with Wonder Cunt. Stand by, everybody. Acho que não vai ter mais nada além do. Deixa eu dar, deixa eu dar o zoom aqui. Pra voltar legal aqui pra vocês assistirem melhor. Consegui ler a legenda melhor. Aí. Go. Tá, eu acho que vai. Until after Patrick. Better, marginally, but yes. Cara, o que é? Gosh, three. Eu não sei, eu não lembro aqui. The robots were all right, I guess. They certainly were. Let's go over to Robin Short now in Western Square, who I believe has got the star of the show, Robin. And we're out until after Patrick. Better, marginally, but yes. Where's the toilet? I think I need to puke. Come on, I'll show you. This way. <laughs> Mas o foda é que não, não abriu aqui a câmera. Acho que bugou. Não abriu a câmera que seria aberta. Eu vou parar e abrir de novo ele. Vai no próximo? Não, acho que era no mesmo. Era na mesma parte, eu acho. Deixa eu ver. Vai no próximo? É assim mesmo? Não, mas não acabou esse. Era comercial essa parte? Será? Pode ser comercial, então. Ah, não, tá certo. Ela chamou alguém. É, então. Por isso que eu tô confuso. Ela chamou alguém. Eu acho que não vai voltar. E acaba aqui. É, esse aqui acabou mesmo. É porque aqui tá eu, B, no signal. Mas eu acho que é o próximo, então. Aqui. É, ó, é esse aqui mesmo. 
Ele separou aqui mesmo. They're all just so full of bullshit, darling. They love you. Mr. Blunderclatch, can I just grab you for a quick word with the NNN? Hello, my darling. So good to see you. Let's move this along though, yeah. I've got real people to talk to. Oh, oh no, man. <laughs> well, Megan, I'm joined by not tá. one, but... This is what we saw. See any time soon? Yeah. Tennis says he's snorting her in the toilets before the night's over. Tá, ele vai separar mesmo. Tá tudo separado aqui. Uh... <laughs> They'll see. Hi, uh, oh, over here. Yeah, it's N N N. Wow, that's quite the quite the statement piece. <laughs> Did you bring your own lunch? <laughs> They'll see. Sorry, is she... She's fine! Oh, okay. <laughs> right. Thank you, Robin! Tá, espera. Chegar no final e voltar um pouco. Oh! Calma, calma. Funerals and bar mitzvahs! Okay. Oh, thank you! Ele vai cheirar Chelsea. as cinza então, mano. Ele é louco. <laughs> Robin has got hold of Jesus. Aí, <laughs> Jesus <laughs> foda, mano. Oh. You know, I actually invented that look. Yeah. You know, I made my ex-boyfriend wear it in the police lineup. He got off. Fed you, led you the green grocer. Doesn't get parole for another six years. Mm. Jesus. <laughs> okay. It's easy. Good to see you. Oh, um, Lil Gigi? Oh, sorry. Back to Jesus. Sorry. Good to see you. <laughs> Ele fica trocando de nome, mano. <laughs> é muito bom, é muito canê, mano. É muito, é muito, é muito. <laughs> agora é ye, agora é ye, mano. It absolutely is. Tá, vamos ver o final. Jesus, mano. O rei da lua, mano. Thank you for your time and good luck with your new life in space. I'm with you, my child. Well, Megan, that's what success looks like. I'm gonna see if we can grab someone else to have a chat. Back to you. Well, that's my holiday to the moon down the toilet. Tá, ok. Não era nada demais. Só a partir de trocar o tempo todo. Ah, aqui, aí que volta. <coughs> you okay? It's just fucking stupid. How am I supposed to talk about something I haven't even seen? Oh, come on, you know what they'll say. It's just the usual shit, isn't it? Amazing night, groundbreaking film, wonderful to be here. Oh, you like my outfit? Oh, thank you so much. It was designed by Free Free Pumpkin Nuts from Territory <laughs> 2. <laughs> Sorry, I... <laughs> Twice. But once, Pumpkin Nuts is not a swear word, thank you. I want a pair of heels by Free Free Pumpkin Nuts. <gasps> oh, no, so you think you do. But actually, it's his cousin that designs shoes better. Mm -hmm. And what's his name? Eli Watercart. No, no, no. Her name oh. is Phoebe Randall. Coming uh, back now, quiet uh, in the studio. Elas estão se dando bem. Thanks, Robin. But I don't like your opinions. But thankfully, we can go back to Patrick now, <laughs> who has another familiar face to catch up with. Oh, Patrick, what's the atmosphere like there? That really was not appropriate, and you know it. We could get sued for libel. You could get sued for libel. Yeah, it was funny. It was though. not funny. It was crass and it was cruel and it makes you look just so... Oh, don't be a bloody hypocrite. Randy Cunt. That is when the cameras are not rolling. There is a difference between who we are, this side of the camera, and then who we show the rest oh, of the world. So you're fake. That's what you're saying. Everybody's a little bit fake, oh, Stacey. I'm fucking not. Stacey, come, come back. Stacey, come back. É por isso sake. então come que ela here. não voltou aquela hora. Caralho, mano. 
Ela tem só 15 anos. <risos> Ela tem só 15 anos. É a parte mais difícil, mano. Vamos ver aqui, ó. O Neil. Neil maluco. Um pouco antes e um pouco depois. Deu Ed? Deu Ed, deu Ed, deu Ed, eu espero. A dor ele sente, é então. Quero ver tudo. Vocês querem ver tudo do, do Neil maluco? Quer ver tudo? Porque o Neil é maluco e ele é muito bom. Beleza, beleza. Tudo bem, tudo bem, tudo bem. Vocês ganharam. Vocês venceram essa, vocês venceram. O sub mode do nada. É então, porque todo mundo que não é sub tá pegando Ed não responde o que eu tô falando. <risos> Então vira sub mode, mano. A não ser que o pessoal que pegou Ed quer falar alguma coisa. Aí é, vira um, um sub mode sem querer. Não intencional. <risos> sub mode não intencional. Acabou o Ed, gente. Acabou Ado. Acabou, acabou. Bulo com os pleb. Não, mano. Eu tô falando. Eu falei com, com os. Falei o um negócio. O pessoal falava sub mode, mano. Bulo nada, eu sempre espero vocês, mano. Nem vem, mano. Nem vem. Se eu pudesse. Se eu pudesse casar com vocês, vocês sabem que eu iria tentar. <risos> Ele é doido, ele é doido, mano. I can't quite believe it either, but he's here. It's crazy Neil. Hey, hi, ho, ele é ele, é ele, Eva. Really, really connected with your ads over the years. What's it like suddenly being so popular? It's crazy. People stop me in the streets. They expose themselves. They write me threatening letters. You know, the stalker has been. Muito bom, mano. Become the stalky. A real taste of Neil's own medicine, if you know what I mean. What's been the most challenging? Com pelado. Beça de morte. Foda, normal, normal. Being around actors and rock stars. They're real crazy, and crazy Neil knows crazy. Ah, é, ele é doido, ele é maluco, mano. Meu maluco, louco. Yes, I can imagine. Louco. But I know what you're thinking. Hey, Neil, where's the crazy deal? Maluco. We got crazy deals on chairs. Ah, é, caralho, é isso. I can't say that I have. Makes a mess of the carpet. But what do you say? We got a deal. Uh, well. Well, what about Betty Andrews' handbag? It's real leather. It's real cheap, and it even contains our heart medicine. Spicy. Uh, no, really. I You've got the chair. You've got the bag. You're really busting my balls. What can I do to convince you? Let me throw in my wife, Mrs. Neal. It's the latest model. Not a scratch on her, pearls like a charm. What do you say? We got a deal. Look, I, I really, I can't take your wife. Yes, you can. I got <laughs> loads of them. Oh. Come on down. A crazy deal. <laughs> we got crazy deals on chairs. We got crazy deals on meals. <laughs> we got crazy deals on wheels. Man, we got take wheels on wheels. Velho, foda. Deals on wheels. We need to get endangered seals. Aí, focas ameaçadas de extinção. Yeah. Extinção. Thank you, Neil. É. Well, it's always a dream come true to meet a hero. How about that, Megan? The man himself. Aren't we lucky? <laughs> Back to you. Agora, vamos lá. O que, que vai acontecer? É a esposa, é a esposa. Um, <laughs> Esporte é bom. Sports board? <laughs> ela, ela posando do lado. Ela fica posando só. Vai pegar os remédios. Olha lá, ela tá posando. Ela ficou lá, posando. Vamos lá. Link Studio 2. Não. 
do not get up from this seat again until the adverts. I'll send someone to find your temporarily adopted monster spawn. You. É realmente, mano. É isso mesmo, né? Ela adotou só para esse programa porque era o dia de levar o filho. E ela não tem um, uma filha, então ela adotou só para esse programa. <risos> É isso mesmo, mano. Ai, muito bom, velho. Muito bom. Ai, caralho, velho. Muito bom, mano. É por isso que a menina é toda brava. Exato, mano. Porque conheceu ela hoje. She literally hasn't said a full word to me since she arrived. Ten seconds, everybody. I bet you're an annoyingly perfect teenager. Yeah, I think maybe I was. Going in five, four, <laughs> three. <laughs> bom, bom. Thanks, Patrick. What a. Que errado, meu. Ah, então esse jogo aqui acabou, mano. Colorful uh, interview there. On... Vamos lá. <laughs> tá. É quando eu saio as coisas. Aí. Jenny? Has anyone seen um, Jenny? Uh, dressing room. Dressing rooms. Ih. E, e ela, ela vai levantar, ela vai levantar. Ela, ela não podia, ela tinha que ficar aí. Ah, ela levantou. Ela fez carinha que tava levantando. Ai, mano. É isso, é isso. Aqui, vamos ver. You're late again. You don't I? I get down to sleep. It's fine. Okay, folks, any moment now. Could you just ficar mais pertinho ele? Eles nem se olham na cara do outro. Né? Well, I thought I saw some leprechauns in the green room, but I think it might have been someone's kids. Tá, vamos ver o final. Excuse me. PhD in biomechanics. You take that back. Well, thanks to you both for pushing the boundaries of human knowledge. Arsol. Crikey! Well, the movie's about to start, so Patrick and I are about to share a box of overpriced popcorn. Back to you, Megan. I'm calling Alice to come get me with Dante. What? You know I don't want him left alone with that. He might pick up his stupid habits. What? Like washing? You're not stuck in an underground cave system anymore, David. Why do you still smell like it? Ih, ele fede, mano. Tá. Que aqui. E ela vai voltar agora. Ela é brava, porque não. Thank you. Are we going to be okay? I don't know. Are you? Ten seconds. I'm sorry for how fuck off are you? Going in five, four, three. Thanks, Robin. É muito foda que ele só é só isso. It's just not the same, is it? You're right. It's better. No unevens chatting and chewing all the way through. Oh, what about a kiss and cuddle on the back row? Doesn't that? Espera. É só essa partezinha. Ah tá. É agora. I still go to the cinema. You should get yourself a video recorder, like the one at the home. Oh yeah, I've got a video recorder. It's just not the same, is it? You're right, it's better. No unevens chatting and chewing all the way through. Oh, what about a kiss and cuddle on the back row? Doesn't that happen anymore? In public? What's wrong with you? Nothing, nothing's wrong with me. Feeling better? All right, you are. I've got to get set up for heat rash. I think Ronnie's on something. I know he is. It was on his rider. Apparently it's medicinal. Ronnie's always high. 
give him orange juice. My God, she speaks. He's a stupid cunt. And just like that, you wish she wouldn't. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Oh, oh, <risos> não pode, né, mano? Em público. Ai, ficar, ficar abraçando em público, mano. Oh, realmente, esse governo aí mudou tudo, né, velho? Caralho, velho. Se abraçar em público, não pode. Que nojo, mano. Uh. We seem to be a bit. Eu acho que aqui tá bom porque pega pega todo mundo. Bunched up at this end. Oh, don't worry, it's Soko. It's what now? So it's... Oh, here's Megan. Uh, she's gonna be interviewing you. Hello. Hi. 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 This is her. Uh, this is Stacy. Well, hello there, Stacy. Fuck off, Ronnie. Oh. <laughs> right. No, I'm sorry, but if we can't be polite, you're gonna have to wait in the dressing room. Whatever. Do you want to go and wait in the dressing room? Hmm? Ooh. No. No, what? Deles aqui. no. Thank you. Okay. And sit up straight. Ooh. You're ruining my shot. That's Jeez. ten seconds, everybody. No co. Fucking right, no co. What's that? What's what's no what's no? Bring in five, four, three. Welcome back. Tá. Vamos ver aqui porque eu acho que agora vai ter a música, né, de novo. E é mais no final quando tem o, enquanto ela tá falando que tem a transmissão, né, o a transmissão torta lá. Eles estão tudo sentado um no outro, assim. Music is dog shit. Okay, here they are. Oh, peraí, que eu quero escutar aqui, ó. Not for me, no. I only listen to blip music and a bit of jizz core. <laughs> um gozo core de leve aí, mano. Pop music is dog shit. Okay, here they are. It's a... É, no co é não coeso. É, é, é gente chata. Seria o cringe, mano. Rash. Ronnie, Chini, TP, Dale, and... Aqui é a música de novo. Oh, wow. Well, wow. fantastic. Thank you, Heat Rash. That was that was actually really good. <laughs> Tá, aí ela vai falar as coisas lá dela. Blá 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 Fala aí, vai, fala isso, fala. Pera aí, enquanto ela tá falando. The news. There's no need. You hear all the important stuff from your mates, so. Dá pra ouvir, dá pra ver a carinha dela. I don't know what's considered important anymore. But I'm pretty sure that it's not rehash movies and fucking boy bands, so. Ish. Anyway. I'm gonna talk about what's important to me. When Advance were first elected, six years ago, I was nine and in a home. Not a family home like you call a home. This was a state children's home. It was, well, it was fucking awful actually. It was like a Charles Dickens book. The roof leaked and the walls were damp some mornings. The food was bad. Drugs and alcohol were everywhere, no one cared. You had to watch your back all the time because there weren't enough staff mama. to manage us. And yes, as you'd imagine, there was a lot of... Some bad stuff went down there with some of the staff, okay? Not all of them, but the others knew and they didn't stop it. And then Advance won the election. And like a miracle, things started to change. They got better. We had nicer food, 
the home was not just repaired but redecorated and kitted out with books and sports stuff and musical instruments and video games. Most of the staff were fired and the new ones, which there were more of, spent time talking and working with the bullies. A atuação é muito boa, velho. É absurdo, mano. A second miracle. Todos os atores são muito bons. Saudade do Jeremy, mano. Saudade. My life got better. Because finally, there was enough money to do the good things and Advance had the guts to do it. I joined Go-Getters and on Liberation Night, that gave me a group of friends that I could talk with when the bombs went off and the power went out. Another miracle. I wasn't alone anymore. And that was the night I finally understood the importance of being in a team. So here's my final thought. I know the people who were doing better under the old system long to go back. You say, we were freer. But what you mean is, we were richer. But for every one of you, there is a hundred of me. And even now, after all you've had taken away, you are still doing better than I am than I likely ever will. You still have homes of your own and families of your own who love you. And I'll never have that. So maybe you should stop looking for the worst interpretation of everything this amazing government does and realize it's not for you. It's for the millions like me. And you can cry and bleat all you want, but you're never going to get your money back because it's already been spent on miracles. Muito bom, mano. Caralho, que reação foda, velho. Ela passou por várias coisas ali, né? Tipo, deu pra ver, tipo, ela passou de, tipo, meio enojada pelas coisas que ela tá falando pra meio triste e depois enojada de novo. Thank you, Stacey, for that. Uh, my name's Megan Wolf. Let's keep making tomorrow better. And we're out. Is that all right? Oh, yes. Yes, that was more than all right. Nicely done. Mm. I think you might have actually given them something to think about. So I guess you're going to be taking me back to the home now then. E? Um, I was thinking we could go out somewhere and, I don't know, have, have a meal. La, la, la. Talk about our options, if that's okay. Of course, Miss Wolf. Security will be standing by. Thank you. So they're always there then. Uh, there was a... A thing. A few years ago now. Oh, with that Jeremy bloke? I heard about that. Everyone did. Were you here back then? Doesn't look old enough. She's growing on me. Yeah, she does that. Ah, ela, ela quer. Ela quer ficar com ela, mano. Ah, que fofinho. <coughs> Faz quanto tempo em game que a Advance ganhou a eleição? Seis anos. Seis anos em game. E a gente tá com o um personagem controlando essa TV e tal, a notícia e as câmeras, desde antes deles ganharem a eleição, se eu não me engano, né? Ou, ou a partir que eles ganharam, eu não lembro. Deu ado? Ok, ok. Foi no dia? Ah, é, eu acho que foi perto, assim, né? Foi... Acho que foi os dois, assim. Quando ganharam, ok, ok. Alec Grego e Little Chaka. Muito obrigado pelo sub. Obrigado, obrigado, gente. Valeu, valeu. Cheflari mandou sub. Muito obrigado. A primeira transmissão foi sobre a eleição. É, eu não lembro, mano. Eu não lembro, eu não lembro. Foi no dia da eleição. Aí foi mudando, ok. Mas que bonitinho, bonitinho. Ela quer ficar com a... Deixa eu tirar aqui, que acabou. Quer ficar com ela. Ah, só teve esses três mesmo. Quero esse aqui. Meu Deus. Songs 
Masters of the New Future. In record shops across the world. Mano, eu queria achar o Enemy Soldier, só que eu não lembro qual, em qual dia que é. Porque Enemy Soldier é, mano, nossa, é muito bom, velho. É muito bom, mano. Unburden me, então, mano. Deixa eu ver. O governo é ruim? É. Esse jogo é de escolha, gente. É muito de escolha. Então, tudo que, você, que eu fui escolhendo mudou muita coisa. Inclusive, umas coisas mi mini. Umas mini coisas que eu escolhi... É... Eu, já, já mudou um monte de coisa assim pra frente. Mas, realmente, tem como você escolher ou ficar neutro, ou a favor do governo, ou contra o governo. Eu tô sendo contra o governo absurdamente, sabe? <coughs> Assiste no YouTube que, mano, é muito foda. Ainda mais que no YouTube dá pra você ficar pulando. Melhor coisa, sabe? Eu gostei dessa interrupção. Isso aqui, mano, isso aqui vai dar, vai dar foda, mano. Vai dar bom, vai dar bom, vai dar bom, mano. E é isso, mano. Por hoje... Por hoje tá bom. Porque sempre demora muito cada dia. Próximo, próxima vez que a gente jogar, a gente joga o próximo dia. A gente vê o que acontece, porque tá indo, mano. Só tá indo muito. E eles voltaram. Eu quero muito ver o que vai acontecer, mano. É muito bom, mano. Esse jogo é muito foda, velho. Good evening. I'm Megan Wolf. Cadê? Uh, tinha um negócio aqui. É... O que tem aqui? Não, não teve esses aqui. Tá. Não, eu tava vendo porque tem... Tem três... Pode ser que são músicas que não apareceu ainda. É que eu, eu sempre vejo músicas novas no, pra Beat Saber. E tem aqui, ó, essas três. E eu não lembro. Eu não lembro de todas as músicas, sabe? Uh, e pode ser músicas que a gente não viu ainda. Eu não lembro, eu não lembro do nome delas. Enemy Soldier. Eu não lembro delas. Ah, então, não lembro. Ladies and gentlemen. Ah, tá aqui. It's the Force's favorite. The Queen of Team. Here to break in your blockades. We'll see. Ah, 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 ah. Some action, so come and break my sanctions. Uh -huh. 
É, então, isso explicaria porque a Lucy tá com o saco na cabeça. Porque ela é a Stacy. Eu não sei se é a mesma, né? Pode ser isso, pode ser isso. Pô, devia ter essa música no Spotify, mano. Eu colocaria fácil na playlist, mano. Ela vai tirar a roupa. Essa é a música do Jesus no celular. Ele tá segurando a arma. Nossa, esse jogo é muito bom, mano. Esse jogo é muito bom. Olha a cara dela, olha a cara dela. Oh, na boa, que foda. Muito bom, mano. Oh, na boa.